Right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back, one and all. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. Oh my goodness, he's a minute late. Look, I've had a busy weekend, okay? It's been Easter. I've been trying to fend my corgi away from eating all of the tiny chocolate eggs that people leave lying everywhere. Like, it's, you know, dog's chocolate, they don't mix. But yes, welcome to Skyrim. Now, of course, if you've seen the title, of today's stream. You know that today is the end of Skyrim. And you might be thinking, oh my god, what do you mean it's the end of Skyrim? I mean, quite literally, it is the end of Skyrim. Um, we've been playing this mod pack for over 40 hours now, and uh, it's been very good fun. I hope you all have enjoyed it. But Chairman Meow has had 100 days to survive in Skyrim. The rules were very simple. Every time Chairman Meow died, the end of the world would move one day closer. The end of the world being Alduin genuinely winning. Uh, there is a mod for it. It is called End Times. Doomsday is now on day 47. Now, that means I've died quite a few times. 53 times, in fact. And that's led to a awkward problem. Uh, we are on day 37.6. We have 9.36 hours remaining. Sorry, 9.36 days remaining. Um, this is not good. Each day is about 20 minutes. If we die, of course, this goes down faster. If we hit the end of this point, the world literally ends. Um, there is a cinematic ending. Um, it's pretty... <laughs> it's going to be pretty interesting. But the way this works is if Alduin is alive and we haven't finished the main quest, then, yeah, we're going to be... Go, Skyrim's going to be not doing too hot. In fact, the entirety of Tamriel um, is going to be destroyed by a big old dragon sat on top of a mountain. Now, we are playing as the wonderful Chairman Meow. We're level 37. Uh, I was going to go into my inventory and show off my items, but I realized the game doesn't pause when I do that because I'm playing an incredibly challenging modded version of Skyrim. Uh, this is like 27 times more difficult than everything you've ever seen. But now we have an OP follower. Um... No, we don't. You might remember at the end of the last stream, we picked up a new follower, and she's really good, but she's really good at fire magic. Alduin currently has a 90% resistance to magic, which means she is useless. <laughs> so yes, we are doing our best to, um, to avoid that, I'd say, which is pretty fun indeed. Anyway, I hope you're all having a wonderful Monday. I hope it's it's bank holiday here in the UK. I don't know if it is um, elsewhere. But yes, in the last stream, we attempted to fight Alduin on top of the throat of the world. We died a lot. Uh, it wasn't even close. We died about eight times and we could do no damage to him. He was regenerating six health per second. Uh, we could not even pull close to that. So yes, this is going to be very challenging and i'm hoping we can pull it off there's a couple of things i think we can cheese but we're going to do our best uh we really are i'm gonna i'm gonna try but of course we can only do it thanks to you all at home so yes your support is very very great your likes on these streams are glorious thank you to the 600 people who've liked the stream already that's exceedingly generous xavier de Starlis, Thank you very much for donating five doularoos to say, as always, I appreciate your content. And I hope you and the missus are doing well. We are doing well. We went to a convention this weekend, so I'm still recovering from being at a convention because they're really active and loud, but it was very good fun. I got to meet a lot of fans. That was really nice. Um, if any of you were there, it was a pleasure meeting you. I signed a bunch of tea bags. That was really fun. Um, Abe, thank you very much for your donation of $20. Say, I would suggest going for Ori outside Falkreath and Remy in the Markov Inn because you can use their summon abilities to bring them into Skoldefan and Sovngarde to fight Alduin. Oh, you see, this is the big challenge. We can defeat Alduin now, but then actually going through the Skull Skoldefan dungeon is insanely difficult. Uh, but I'm going to do my best. Um, oh, and also, Abe, thank you very much for another $20 donation to remind me of the very important Jaren route. Don't worry, um, I did actually see this suggestion on the Discord, which was probably from you as well. And yes, we are going to be uh, using it to the best of our abilities. Uh, where's this horsey going? Let me pull this horse back, as we need to actually head back. We left a dragon priest. Um, oh, I suppose I'm stealing the pony. Does anyone care? No. Um... We actually left a dragon priest behind, and we need to go and defeat them. So that's my plan. Um, how's Mango? Mango's doing good. Last time I checked, she's doing great. Oh, loads of potato plants. 
Oh, there's Gladys the Corgi. I forgot about Gladys the Corgi. Our good little furry friend. Right, let us swim. Come on, horsey. Swim, swim, swim. Swim, 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 swim. Oh. What, this is about to end? I just got hit. Yeah, Skyrim is not looking too hot right now. Um, uh, oh, can I catch a car pause fishing? Yes, I can. Um, <laughs> but yeah, Skyrim is going to end unless I can somehow defeat Alduin in nine days, which is going to be <laughs> not easy. I really, I really think I can. There you go. Someone was at the convention. Michael says, um, Jenga is perfectly balanced. Indeed, it was. I'm glad you saw me perform the greatest game of Jenga anyone in the world has ever seen. So that temple -y thing over there straight on is where we actually need to head. This is um, this is our lovely dungeon. And yes, we'll be smashing it. Thank you very much, Al Alessandro and the wonderful ghost. Wow, you don't even have a username. Um, I don't even know how you get a blank username on YouTube, but congratulations. Thank you for gifting a bunch of memberships. That's really, really nice of you. That's exceedingly generous. You don't have to do that. That's the gift of giving. And if you've received a gifted membership, make sure to say thank you to them. If you didn't, make sure to flame them. <laughs> thank you very much, Brad G, as well, for donating 20 doolaroos to say, Hello, Spiff. When can we expect a pre-cut and exploit with YouTuber YMFAH? I mean... We have we have spoken quite a lot. Um, he's an incredibly good exploiter and gamer. Um, however, our styles of content just don't really match each other. He's a he's a great creator, but I think if I ever tried to work with him, I'd kind of ruin his craft a bit because his style is so different. Um, yes, uh, <laughs> Lixbox says it's a shame that Bethesda is filing for bankruptcy and Skyrim Two being cancelled sucks. Yeah, it's a shame they're taking down the Skyrim servers as well. Uh, this is the final stream of Skyrim. Um, it's just how it is. Right, into the dungeon we go. Um, I think our other companion should still be around here and join us. Uh, but yes, this is Highgate Ruins. We did clear it out mostly last stream. How do I get off you again? Do I hold down E? Yes, I do. Whoop. Cape goes funky. That's looking good. Right, into the dungeon we go. Um, now, of course, we are fading off again. Fading off against quite spicy Draugr, but we can do our best. And, of course, also a Dragon Priest at the end. But yeah, we're going to... Um, do our best to ignore that. Oh yeah, I need my um, what's my magical ability? Hunter's sight. There we go, Zed. Uh, yeah, these are our two companions, Belrand and Inigo, and then here's Anska, who was insanely good fire wizard. She's just great. So yeah, she's going to be joining us for the ride. Um, let us cleave our way through these ruins. And my goodness, Heather Mullins, thank you so much. Fifty dollars. That's absurdly generous, my friend. You don't need to donate that kind of money. Wow. Thank you so much. That's really, really nice of you. Thank you. Um, I think there might be a faster way out of here. Um, although actually, we might just have to do the whole thing again. Maybe. I can't remember. Uh, do, 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 do. I do remember several of the pathways. Uh, this way definitely isn't the path. No, it's not. Right. This way. Yeah, it's been like a week and a bit since I last played. Um, right. I think this way. Uh, and then this way. Uh, yep, this is where there's like the suicide culty thing. That's all weird. Basically, a bunch of oh, whoa, Woo! <laughs> that was almost the first death of the stream. Do not want that happening. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna have to run around that. <laughs> my goodness, my heart can't take it. Oh my god. So yeah, if you don't know the rules, basically every time I die, I lose a day. So yeah, if we hit that, that's an entire day gone. Uh, we don't want that happening. Right. We've got to go kill this dragon priest. Every dragon priest we kill, that's a huge debuff to Alduin. In this case, this lowers his magic resistance by 20%. So, um, it's very important that we get him. Uh, right. Through here we go. I've got to remember there are a bunch of other traps as well. I remember them on the, uh, on the way out. Um, do, 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 do. Right. This way. There was one around here, I think. Maybe just around the corner. Um, oh, that's one. If I've ever seen one, jump. Um, then there's... Is there one over here? Wait, why are there Draugr here? Oh, yeah, these ones only come out if we pick up the crystal, which we're not going to do. We don't need it. Um, right, we need to go this way. I remember that. Whoa, 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 whoa! Ow. 
<laughs> okay, that actually didn't do too much damage. I'm surprised because my character is literally glass cannon. Oh my god. Thank you very much, Nico Van Heck, for gifting five memberships and Craig Downs for donating two pounds. Thank you very much. You've come, you've been watching for ages and keep up the great work. Thank you. I will do my best. Um, yes, I remember it's through here into Vulcan's throne room. I do believe this is the man we're going to be fighting. Should be uh, should be important, but it's a greater crystal. No, we don't need to. Last stream we we discovered how to infinitely clone um, minor soul gems. So I have quite a few of them, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I've got how many do I have? Uh, I've got thirty four petty soul gems, and I think my corgi has a bunch as well. Speaking of which, actually, I might need to top up my bow. Uh, yeah, it needs charging. Let's give it a, a couple of petty soul gems seeing as we have so many of them um, and then into here we go oh yep this looks like the man oh this is the man indeed okay I was not expecting it would just be straight into the boss fight but oh what is this what is this oh, 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 oh okay no 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 what is my healing key again what is the healing key I've forgotten the healing key Abe my goodness you've become a hundred stat member that's insane thank you very much that's ridiculously generous it's x isn't it it's x drink it drink it drink it drink it no. oh god damn it <laughs> that's the first one of the stream <laughs> it's x i bound my healing key to um Oh my god. Uh, I don't even know what kind of magic he used on me, because that was just immediate death. Uh, so as you know, the rules are quite simple. The world was going to end in nine days' time. We now bring that forwards by one day. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, we're going to do good. White Run Guard, <laughs> 173. Don't it? What the f 500 Australian dollars. I have been a big fan for years. Keep up the amazing work. Holy. Oh my God. Oh my God. Thank you so much. Um, geez. Oh my God. How many main quests are left? Uh, I think there's about three or four main quests left in eight days. Uh, that's frost magic. Okay, have I got a potion of frost resistance at all? Um, Ice Wraith Essence, Frost Resistance for 90 seconds. Uh, that actually is probably a good idea. So might an Invisibility Potion, to be honest. Um, Shroud Potion, yes, I need to bind you. Yes, I need to bind you. You can basically keep me alive. The, all of this poison stuff is useless because they're resistant to it all. Um, but Ice Wraith Essence probably be our best bet. Yeah, I don't think I've got anything better than that. Frost Resistance plus one. Um... Make myself 18% harder to detect. Why not? Yum, 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 yum. And then also chug an ice wave essence. All right. All right, let's go crouching. And then That's here's my boy. Oh, 5.8 times damage because of sneak. There we go. There we go. There we go. Big hit. Oh, he summoned a boy. A skeleton champion, level 40. Nope, we don't like any of that. But we're in. Look at us go. Good job, Inigo. He's down to 1,000 health. Inigo needs some help. Oh, God, I'm I'm frozen. I'm frozen. I'm frozen. Drink, 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 drink. Right, big hit. What? Who's doing frost damage to me? Oh, it's my, it's my bloody... It's my bloody assistant. It's the mercenary I hired is actually doing frost damage to me. That's insane. Right, come on, big damage. Come on, come on, come on. I believe, chat, I believe. We can do it. We can do it, come on, walk away. Why is he gaining health? And why is he coming towards me? Please don't come towards me, please. <laughs> please, oh. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Bellrand is almost down. Oh, he's draining life. He's That's how he's doing it. When he's near people, he drains their life. Nope. No, 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 no. You don't get to do magic damage to me, friend. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Heal, 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 heal. Heal. Healing is not good enough. Healing is not good enough. Healing is really not good enough. Food. 
Mammoth cheese ball. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> Oh, we are so screwed. We are so screwed. I've got... This is seven days now. Oh, my God. White Run Guard, I still can't believe. 500 Australian dollars is actually wild. Um, Stephen Burton, thank you as well. 100 US dollars. Oh, my God. Thank you so much. That's incredibly generous. And to the 1,500 people who like the stream, thank you as well. That does huge wonders for the YouTube algorithm. You're all far too generous. Um, we've got a... Gosh, we're down to seven days to save Skyrim. Oh my god. All right. Do we, do we want to go for the Daedric Exquisite Crossbow? I mean, give this a try. We can really give it a try. We'll give the Daedric Crossbow a try. Um, oh my god. Uh, Shroud Potion, of course, we're going to need Favorited. I think actually maybe chugging an Invisibility Potion isn't a bad idea. We can definitely chug the Ice Wraith Potion. Stream might end soon. It, pff, I hope it doesn't. Um, potion of Extra Health. Let's go. That's 850 Extra Health. Um, have I got any food that just gives, like, frost resistance? Not really. Health regeneration boost, though, from the cheese bowl. Ooh, room chest key. Nice. Okay. Everyone, let's go. Um, right, crouch. That was sneak. Sneak and critical. That's a thousand damage. Oh, and that was just a miss. Okay, right. I'm going to... Uh, try and do a potion of invisibility, which will make me stealth again. And then I'm hoping that in doing so, I can then reload. I have no idea where I am. I think this is him. There we go. That's another critical strike. There we go. That's another big hit. Oh, my God. It really would help if my allies weren't getting murdered by him. And having their health drained. Right, here we go. Healing. That was just a miss. That was just a straight up miss. He's down. He's going low though. He's really low. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. He's low. He's on 300. Alright, quick. I'm going to need like stamina and healing potions, right? Um... Potion of the Defender, quick. Um, oh my god. I just drank a Magicka Potion. Right, potion of Invisibility. There we go. He's down to 200. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 76, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! He's dead! Oh, yes! Yes! Oh, that was... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. We did it. Oh, my... Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Oracle, thank you so much for donating $50. That's exceedingly generous of you. Oh my god, Clockwork Aubrey said, would uh, give more, but my first tattoo tomorrow. Sorry, they're pricey. Of course they are. Don't worry, my friend. You don't need to gift anything. You don't even need to donate. Just being here to support me is enough to witness that incredible fight. We did it. Oh my god, we did it. Oh, the boy is dead. He makes spells cheaper. Well, I don't care about that. Gloves and boot. Movement speed increased. Magic's nonsense. A staff that does poison damage, and uh, the rest is meaningless. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Oh my goodness, we did great. We did incredible. Um, the staff must be in the next room. What next room? I guess there's some way through here, maybe, because of the puzzles. I'm uncertain. Oh, it's through here. Whew. He's done it now. Skyrim is saved. Um, unfortunately not. No, that's not how it works. Ooh, a chest. Yoink. Amethyst. 
Um, and the rest of you is not that useful. Right, let's go down and get this word wall. Oh my goodness. Um, oh, we did storm call. Fun. Fun, 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 fun. Lovely. Right, let's grab this uh, special scrolly thing. Sealed scroll. There we go. Let me give this scroll over to her. Uh, I really want her as a companion because she's incredibly good. Yeah? There we go. I've retrieved the scroll. For all of the help. Um, here is the scroll. Here's a little something for helping me out. What do you give me for helping you out? A spell term of Conjure Familiar. That's completely useless for me. Belrand, you can have that. Um, I need to trade some things sure with you. Thing. Uh, please, can you take this? Uh, probably a lot of this, this like armor, because I can't really use it. Um, it's too heavy. You can have his boots. That'll make you run faster. And his magic gloves. Um, it's all quite. It's all heavy armor, so not really that useful for me. There you go. Ooh, robes are kind of okay though. Uh, you can probably have that. That'll probably help you. Um, yeah. Right, cool. I think that's good. We've lowered all of the stuff we're ha carrying. Spiff save. Yeah, I'm dropping down the save. I'm dropping down the save. I've saved. There we go. Right. Um, let me go have a chat with her because I'm hoping maybe she's like, oh, you know, maybe I will stick you around. Possibly be the dragonborn of legend, could you? I am, and Skurin, you should follow me to fight Alduin. Hmm. It's encrypted. It'll take a while. It'll take a while to figure out. Wait, let me guess. She's not going to join me until after she's figured it out, which by that time, Skyrim will have been entirely destroyed. <laughs> oh, I can unlock this key. Potions last 20% longer and superior armor rating. Welkin stone, flawless ruby. Draft of conjuration is meaningless. Oh my god, chat. That was a hell of a fight. Thank you for the 2,000 people who've liked the stream. That's very generous of you. Um... Spiff, did you see Brandon Hart gifted a hundred sub gifts? I no, I did not see that. What? I did, Jesus Christ, Brandon Hart! Thank you so much. <laughs> what is going on with you guys today? It's a bloody Monday. It's a Monday, guys. Whoa, Monday isn't for being incredibly generous. It's for selfish nonsense. I don't know. All right, out into high great ruins. Spiff, don't forget the infinite potion quest. What, the one where, with the, like, the reusable healing potion? I don't really know how useful that is, though. Let me activate the chain. Right, out we go. There she is. Is she gonna want to... Oh, maybe we're meant to go that way. I'm not sure. Hello. Sometimes I just like to watch them burn. Go, okay, keep that to yourself, lady. Um, this way, maybe? Oh, no, this is the entrance, so it's back out this way. Good day. Okay, so she doesn't want to get recruited. Are you sure? Mm. Oh, damn it. I really thought I'd be able to keep you at the end of this quest, but maybe not. Maybe I don't. That's okay. We can maybe make this work. We're going to need to do some crazy potion, uh, potion, potion stuff, though. These uh, donations want to send off your Skyrim series with a bang until April the 2nd. I know. This has been... Honestly, this has been the most fun I've ever had in a game series, ever. I mean, look at... We've spent over 40 hours on this single character, which is wild. Like, 92 locations discovered, um, 11 dungeons cleared, 37 days passed. Like, look at all of this. 70,000 gold found. <laughs> 129 food eaten, 345 chests looted. We've never owned a house. Oh, we've owned one horse. That's true, we did do that. Um, 260 people killed, 195 animals, a lot of undead. Uh, how many dragons have we done? Bunny slaughtered. We've only killed one bunny. It's not bad. In terms of crime, we do still have a bounty in Hjalmark. Um, we've stolen a lot of items, but you know, that's okay. That's completely fine. Um, oh. Spiff, you can use a tanning rack to turn dragon priest masks into belts to wear three at a time. What? What? No. No, 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 that can't be right. Is that, if that's actually legitimate, we are about to go quite silly. Let us see. All right, steal the pony, steal the pony. Let's go to uh, Solitude. Um, I don't really know if there's any more easy to access Dragon Priest we can actually pick up. So this might be the end of our Dragon Priest hunt. We might now have to start prepping for Alduin um, and his... What, 5,000 health I think he's going to have? 
Um, Spiff, please fix in Nigo's inventory. He's full of ingredients. Yep, don't worry. I'll be doing that when we get to solitude. Is this run without exploits? Uh, if I find exploits, I will use them. The main issue we have is that all of the exploits you might know from my videos have been patched, which is very, very challenging indeed for someone like me. Also, I just realized YouTube added a new feature whereby I can actually... No, nope, no. Nope. I can actually view my own live stream on my phone and I can see... There we go. The lovely, generous fan donations. Big Salty, thank you very much for your $20. I'd say thank you for your distraction. Well, thank you for the distraction from work. Well, I'm glad uh, you are being distracted. I hope your job isn't like truck driver, else there's going to be problems. Or like you're a heart surgeon, and like someone's having some open heart surgery. And you're just like, oh, sorry, guys. I'm, I'm sorry I accidentally cut a, a severe artery. I was just having a grand old merriment at the sight of Chairman Meow exploring through... Um, uh, <laughs> through, uh, through Skyrim. Oh my goodness! Fawn Drow says, "FYI, YouTube allows fake super chats today." I mean, if they did, that'd be hilarious. If they really did, I honestly, I would love YouTube. That would be brilliant. Connor, you've been a member for fifty months. You lazy bastard. Jeez, you should up those numbers. Ah, oh, these interns. I can't believe it. <laughs> Uh, Mitchell Ryan says, jokes on you, we've been giving you Monopoly money. I knew it! There was something suspicious with these big donations. It doesn't make sense, does it? <laughs> Truck driver here, need background noise. Yeah, but you wouldn't, I mean, I suppose I'm imagining it where you have like a laptop set up on the dashboard and you're just watching the live stream. Because um, <laughs> yeah, you could definitely watch this, I guess, a bit like a podcast. Um, right, you are a stolen horse, so I'm probably not going to want to take you into the town. I'm just going to leave you there. Um, into the town we go. Uh, Lord Spiff, could you tell us what you're doing? Yes, I am playing Skyrim. Uh, this is a 100-day series where every time I die, I lose a day. And I've died so much and I've spent so much time in the game, we now have seven days. Uh, at the end of the 100 days, Alduin wins, basically. He... He just wins. There's an animation and everything. And the only way for me to stop that is to kill Alduin. He is quite challenging to kill, as you can imagine, being a level 90 dragon nonsense. Yes, it's it's pretty spooky. Scott Wiggum, he's back from the last stream and the stream before that and the stream before that to gift 50 memberships. Thank you so much, Scott Wiggum. That's incredibly generous. That's your that's your theme song now. You can take that and use it. Um, that's your copyright. I'm giving it to you. Uh, thank you so much. You've always been incredibly generous throughout these streams, and I hope you're you're going to enjoy the final stream we ever do of this series because I've certainly enjoyed it. It's been great. Um, Jason Isaac says this series got me playing Skyrim again with mods. Uh, do do the mods change the Golden Hills plantation? Um, the people there are still alive. Seriously, I've i the only I only know the Golden Hills plantation as you know the place where all the people are already dead, but. That's crazy if they're, they're still alive. Ooh, we should probably enter into this. I'm also going to drop down a quick save because there's a chance with the way the buildings work I just get yeeted out into the sky. Um, I heard the 50 gift subs of April Fools. Well, yeah, but Scott Wiggum has been doing this like every week, so I'm going to I'm gonna give him the benefit of the doubt that this is an uh, April Fools donation. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? You have got some nonsense. Let's sort by price. Your blocks, you your block, you block fifty percent more damage. Okay, well I basically never block. Fire resistance increased by fifty percent. Could keep me alive against Alduin actually, so I will grab that. Shock resistance. Um, I think it's mostly like ice resistance is the main thing we could probably use. You reflect forty percent of incoming melee damage. Well, I just get murdered, so that's useless. Draft of the shroud is good though. We have several of those. Um, this is 20%, so that's meaningless. Right. Let's sell some stuff. What stuff do I have? I've got a bunch of ingredients that I could probably do with selling. Vampire dust, spade tails. A lot of this kind of nonsense. What I do want from you, maybe, is do you have anything that fortifies archery? Um, nope. 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 Fortify sneak attacks is not the same. Nope. 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 Oh my goodness. It really isn't. River Betty. Oh, we haven't eaten a River Betty or a Cyrodiilic Spade Tail or an Absian Longfin. 
I didn't realise we had all of these ingredients I hadn't already munched on. Alright, let's give him a little chomp. Um, Absolutely long fin, let's eat you. Fortify sneak, fortify speed, and fortify restoration. Of course, that's the classic. Cyrodiil and Spade Tail. I remember that all of these are different to the base game. Uh, so if you're reading the wiki, it doesn't really help. Um, was it River Betty is the other one I don't know? Oh, and I suppose Rock Warbler as well. There we go. Oh, Wisp Wrappings. Yeah, we could eat that. All of these important discoveries. I think the rest of this we pretty much know. Right, apparently Inigo needs me to save what him as well, because uh, apparently okay. it's all the ingredients Let in his inventory that are weighing him down. So let me take all of these. Jeez, I didn't realize how many bees we had. Uh, this is the last series of this. Yes, this is the last episode of the Skyrim series. Uh, it's a hell of a great series. Do 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 do. Come on, pick it up. I mean, no wonder Nigo's had problems carrying stuff. Like I've I've just rammed his inventory with a bunch of a bunch of ingredients. Okay, there we go. I've taken it all. He can now carry things. Hopefully, we would hope so. Um, got a bunch of bows on him. Oh yeah, he doesn't have any arrows. That was the thing we discovered. Do not get ripped off. Right. Got um, where is your potion, potion making dice. table? It's Where's your potion making table? Where is it? You don't even have one. Please come and browse our goods. God damn it! I've got. Take a look. Let me just sell you a bunch of stuff that I don't need. Um, uh, what don't I need? Um, a bunch of bees. I don't need 31 bees in my inventory. As as nice as bees are, there we go. We can take have a bunch of those. Let's actually sort by weight. Charred skiva hides. Yeah, they're not really good. Glow dust is also kind of meaningless. Um, rock warblers, also not useful. None of you are useful either. Um, hanging moss. Fortified one-handed and damaging weapon isn't great. Uh, garlic, also pretty bad. Uh, what about you? Nope. Lingering damage health was never quite useful. Hagraven Claw could be good, though. I hope that How overweight am I? Business with us again. Imagine quite heavy. Lingering damage magicka. Fortified sneak attacks. Hagraven Feathers. None of these are pretty good. Quite a lot of feathers, though. Um, juniper Berries. Oh, Juniper Berries are fortified marksmen. Yes, right. I really need to go basically find if I can make a fortify a marksman potion. That's all I really need to do. Um, Gladys, I need you to carry something. We have seven days. Um, you can carry some ingredients on you. We don't need this. We don't need bees. We don't need you. Uh, fortify sneak attack, maybe. Uh, maybe restore health as well, actually. You're pretty meaningless. You're pretty meaningless as well. So you, uh, so you, and so you. I wonder if we could make a potion that's strong enough to like calm Alduin, like just a fortify calm one hundred level potion. Uh, elves here, great. We need you. Fire salts. We can use fire salts for. Um, I think it's. Um, what is it? It's. Oh, hawk feathers, nice. Um, we can use them for. What is it? Oh, fire arrows. I think. Although they're quite kind of dangerous. I think Alduin is slightly weak to fire. I think someone was telling me. Uh, I don't need all of those. Uh, what if I got a huge number of you? You can go. Okay, and there we go. I've given, Al I've given Gladys as much as I can. I don't think I'm overweight anymore. Great. Right, let's go up into solitude and get making. Oh, that dog needs a vet. Look, it's fine for Gladys to have 700 oh, bees it? inside of her. Um... What is up with my, my mouse? My little crosshair was going crazy there. Um, does watching on TV, PC, and phone add free viewers? Um, it does actually add free viewers, yes. It also adds three times watch time. Um, if you were to have like the same tab open on a Chrome browser, it wouldn't. But if all of you right now watching were to duplicate the stream on a second tab and then have the two tabs open at the same time on your screen, kind of like having one screen on one side and one on the other, then yes, that does count as two views. Oh, um, and it is pretty pretty cheesy. Hello, you. Oh, no, you're the adopt cat. I don't want you. Where's the where's the trade cat? What's this? Walking the World Volume 11. Actually, maybe I could get some training in lockpicking. Because I can get leveled up off of this, maybe. 
This is my thinking. I've got a lot of money, right? So... Yeah, potentially this is just an easy way to get levels. Although it does cost a huge amount of gold to do it. Um, but yeah, there you go. That's a, that's a fun YouTube exploit. I hope you guys uh, enjoy that. Do with that what you will. Although I have just noticed we have 6,666 viewers. <laughs> a perfect number. Um, Kevin, thank you very much for a hundred US dollar donation to say this is a bribe for you to start the next Skyrim 100 days playthrough. That's one hell of a way to do it. Oh, hey, sold. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Thank you. Letter from Tyra Bloodfire. Okay, we can give this a read. What is this? Um, do 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 do. Um, Chairman Meow. My name is Tyra Bloodfire. Like Sol, like Sotied the. Wet ear before me. I'm an orphan child of Balmora. What? Um. What? What? Oh, you want me to do some kind of like noble hero quest? Come on! I'm busy. I'm trying to like save the world. I don't have time for helping the poor people of the world. That can that can maybe come after. Maybe emphasis on the maybe because geez. Um, Crave with chest hair is way overpowered. I mean, I can't recruit him, Juve. That's the problem, goddammit. I've got seven days. Seven days to beat this goddamn game. Do you have any idea what that's gonna mean? Can I have training in alchemy? Oh my god. Lamy in Morphal. I don't like, I don't hate Morphal. I'm going to Morphal. Um, do you, do you sell stuff? Come on, please, can you... Don't care about that. Do you have anything for sale that's useful, woman? Um, or is it just your, like, assistant daughter who has it? Where the hell? You are... You, come on. Just a bunch of nonsense. Well, at least you have an alchemy table I can use. Oh, there's a lady up there. Maybe. Lady up there. Come on, lady up here. Do you sell stuff? Can you sell stuff to me? wrong room hello lady oh man oh it's Belrand Belrand <laughs> that's my companion guys he's just making himself at home um, okay now you're behind the counter can you sell me stuff Need something? no you're you are so useless woman <sighs> um, thank you very much Kevin for oops bribe yes you said bride um, that's pretty funny um, Neonia Nay, Nyan, Nyan Kai Aita donated a hundred knock. Yes, I read out your donation, but I did not read out your name. Um, and I gave it a good attempt there. And I hope you're happy with it, because that's the best I'm able to do. Right, I can make these uh, potions of the marksmen, which are kind of the best thing I can do in order to potentially survive. Damage armor can also be decent. Um... So we'll do that. Damage Magicka seems meaningless. Uh, Calm is not going to help. Um, fortify Health, maybe. We can try this. A couple of these. Um, fortify Stamina uh, could be a good idea. Yeah, in your Stamina is increased by 30 points. Okay, Draft of Extra Stamina. Ooh, and you reflect additional melee damage. Ah, oh, why not? We can make a Giga Potion. That boosted my alchemy up even more. Um, fortify restoration power. Nope. Fortify unarmed. Invisibility. Lingering damage magicka. That could affect Alduin. Maybe we could make something like this. Uh, it does not... Seems It does seem kind of slow, because I reckon he'd just be able to out-heal it. Um... Paralysis as well is one of those things where, like, we can't ever make a paralysis potion strong enough. Um, but we could maybe do a resist frost. Um, we can do... Oh, you move silently for 37 seconds. Why not? We can make a big boy. Um, what is this? And restore stamina. Nine stamina per second. Oh, well, we can make this. Awesome. Incredible. And what's this? Your magic resistance is increased by 30%. And your magic is increased... Okay, this is just flat magical resistance. Um, not resist frost, but fine. Uh, do, 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 do. Bam, we'll grab that. Silence. Silencing him would be great, but we definitely can't do that. Weakness to fire. 
Maybe we could hit him with a weakness. Oh, this is frost. Weakness to frost. Um, let's go weakness to fire. Reduce enemy fire resistance. This could help against Aldwin. Maybe. Or actually, our, our one of our little boys mostly does frost magic. So let's try a resistance to frost. There we go. Bam. Good stuff. And I think that's a level up as well. Nope, that's not even a level up. Wow. It's close. <laughs> Uh, does your challenge include uh, to beat the DLCs as well? No, it is literally just Aldwin. If Aldwin is alive when the uh, 100 days runs out, then he just the, the game has a cutscene and it's over. But of course, I have seven days left. In fact, actually, I don't even know if I have seven days left anymore because it's, it's late at night. So system mod con config uh, end times. I have 7.1 days left. Okay. Can I help you? That's okay. That's okay. We can do this. Um, is bits and pieces open? We can trade with them. Um, oh dear. Is the lady here to for me to sell stuff to? No, she's what at the pub. Of course she is. Oh, hello, child. I thought adventurers were supposed to look tough. Yo, okay, kid. Huh? You gonna? Yeah, you best. You best. Fuck. Fuck you, kid. Fuck you. I hate yes. you. If I could kill you legally, I would. Um, that's very mean of you. Um, <laughs> don't forget uh, forgets your hagbane poison. Oh, yeah, I, I won't. I've got... Um, so the most powerful thing I have is the deadly poison plus one, which is it deals 1,415 poison damage. And then, of course, Hag's Bane can silence Aldwin for 60 seconds, which means he shouldn't be able to scream like an absolute lunatic, hopefully. Right, we're going to try this tanning rack. Um, because apparently I can make belts. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's do this. Uh, was it... Okay, here we go. Clothing, rag or belt left. Oh, this is how you do it! Okay, well, we don't need... Okay, Volsung, let's go a belt left. So this will boost our magic and stamina. Then we'll have... Um, oh, I need leather strips. Okay, I, can I make leather strips? I'm able to make them. Dirty bandage. Uh, where's leather strips? Um, okay, no, I, I need some leather. Right, let me quickly buy some leather strips. Hello, can I buy some leather strips? Wanderer like you must have plenty of tales. Okay, you're not you're not trading with me but because it's not the correct time. God damn it. Um, there's some leather strips there. Um <laughs> what, what are you doing? What are you doing, Belrad? Virad, what is going on? I've just noticed. Um Yeah, Gladys, I'm not gonna question that. Uh let's quickly yoink. And Okay, so we got one leather strip. Um, that'll do nicely. Belrand, I, um, I need to trade something sure with thing. you. You've got Croesus, which is your stamina is increased by 50 and you absorb stamina, which I actually think is really... This one is a good one for us because it gives us stamina bonuses. So in turn, I'll give you the one that we can't use, which is um, this one here, Vokan. Your alteration conjuration spells uh, cost less magic. There you go. You can have that one. I do still want this one because um, this one's great. Having potions last Is longer. Anything else you need? It's a very unique. Is that a plus eighty fortified smithing um, broom? Is that that's what's happening? It's pretty skilled. Oh, I could just make leather. I didn't even need to steal that. Right, let's make some leather. Make some leather strips. Um, Croesus belt. Was the belt I made left or right? Now I need to remember. Um, belt left. Okay, so I want belt right. Um, ragot belt right. Do, 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 do. Is this the correct one? Yes, it is. Oh, is it Croesus? Yeah, it is Croesus belt right. I want right. Yep. You're pretty good as well. Um, which ones have I got? Can I use... Am I, can I turn you into one as well? Am I allowed to wear multiple belts? 
Because someone said you can have... Oh, I suppose you can have three effects. Okay, Rygot is the one that we've got on our face. Um, then we're having... Uh, do 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 Where are they? Where are the belts? Uh, here we go. Croesus belt right, stamina, boost. Volksen belt left, another boost. And then Ragot on the face, amazing. Okay, this is now a pretty, pretty big buff, I would say. The Tea Guy Tom! Oh my goodness, my friend! My friend, Tea Guy Tom, hello. I saw your tweet at me today. If you don't know, in the chat, Tea Guy Tom is a Rust streamer who pretty much exclusively makes tea farms, which I'm sure we can all get behind very, very much so. Um, he's a very, very fun creator. Very much well worth a watch, in my opinion, but I am biased, of course, um, as I like all tea-based content. Alchemy? Uh, I, my alchemy is still only, like, it's really quite low, surprisingly. Potions last longer. Might actually be a good idea just to pick up. Because we go through quite a few potions now. Um, yeah. And there's not exactly much else I'm going to be able to sink into that. I might use this tanning rack just to see what I can make. Um, in terms of... Uh, actually, I don't think this gives me experience when I make these, does it? Um, yeah, I'll make some leather plates. Let's make some big leather. Fur crafting kit. Fun. Shooting stars leaflet. Or are they moon tits? What? <laughs> what is that? I'm not going to question that. I know what that could be. I know what that could be. But yeah, thank you so much, T-Guy Tom. This is a bribe, of course, because he um, uh, he, he ripped us off. He completely ripped us off. Uh, definitely. That's exactly 100% what he did. Um, he's an evil man, but he bribed me, so now we love him. Thank you. Turns out everything can be solved with money. Oh, I can make some ebony rings. That could level me up. Um, mage backpack. I mean, these are kind of worth some cash. Kind of. What's the highest value thing I can make? Uh, ebony ring. Okay. And then this weird raven hood. Uh, what's the most expensive thing I can't make? I like a little solitude. Do, 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 do. It is Vulcan's armor. Oh, this thing's just actually quite crazy. Uh, gold arcane double ring. Jesus Christ, this stuff's wild. Shellbug helmet. <laughs> Who doesn't love the shellbug? Um, right, let's just make some some stuff and then, I don't know, I guess drop it on the ground. These leather helmets are okay. There you go. Uh, fur backpack. Bam, there you go. I'm going to have to make an ebony ring in order to level up. But there we go. There, That's level. Oh, we did it. And I can't even sell these because all the shops are open. Um, and eventually we will need to have a sleep because my character's getting tired. But I want to try and... I really want to try and level up as much as I can, can I before we actually reach that point. Um, so yeah, that's all I'm... That's what I'm going to try and do. Uh, when are you kicking Alduin's butt? Hopefully soon. You should see me when you get bored, stranger. Oh, God, that bloody Argonian. Um, I mean, there's a chance we might be able to pick up an additional companion over here. Like, I don't know how many companions I'm allowed. We need the Wabberjack. We have the Wabberjack. We got it, and it's useless in this mod pack. It's really weak. Um, right. Uh, James Humphrey says, My added incentive to make the next 100 days run heavy armor two-handed build. That would actually be pretty fun. Welcome to the winking ski um, What have you got for sale? Drink for the thirsty. Food for the hungry. And by that I mean, what can I sell you? Um, elves ears yeah you can have all of this you can have a lot of this nonsense salt piles oh actually that I can use that um, can I rent a room if I had even a pot to piss in I'd gladly share sorry oh, okay so they don't have a room that's what he means by that <laughs> oh dear Scott Wickham says it was a leap year this year you can add an extra day no that's not how this works Hello. We are we are screwed but forever, I'm afraid. You might want to that right, I need to find ah, someone who can potentially train me. Can you train anything? Isn't the bully that goes around hurting people? The bully that goes around hurting people. I'm not that bad. Hello. Jeez, you've got blood all over you. Okay, what about you? Yes, I was. My father was always angry. Who are you? I need to speak to him. No. What about you? 
How about you? Oh, it's the executioner who you can hire. You look strong. Thanks. What can I say? I had to train. Uh, can you teach me how to build up muscle? I'll teach you to exercise. Come on. Oh, wait, is there a time skip happening? What? Stay in shape added. Thanks for the tips. Did that lose me any time? I don't think that lost me any time, guys. What is stay in shape? Or is, was it literally a book called Stay in Shape? What the hell is Stay in Shape? Apologies. What the hell is Stay in Shape? <laughs> There's stamina. Nope. I guess it's literally just a buff. I once captained a ship called the Argent Raptor. She struck an iceberg and went down just north of the So the soldiers used to be more lively before the war. Okay, there's no one useful here. Yeah? Why? Jesus Christ. <laughs> These people are crazy in here. The taverns are always wild. Um, yeah, I've got life detecting vision, which is why um, I'm able to do well. Uh, well, why I'm able to see everything through walls. It's not like Skyrim wall hacks. Although, actually, life detection is Skyrim wall hacks. Uh, it definitely is. Hello, are you a trainer? You wouldn't have a few minutes to run down to the docks. With no, I can't be bothered to go down to the docks. Oh, seems like a tough time to be Hello, gentlemen. Huh? What? Who are you? Oh, you, you come to steal my dragon breath <laughs> mead? Well, too bad. I'm not here to steal so your dragon breath you. mead. All I'm not. Right. Don't worry. I'm gonna go to the palace because they have the de they have the destruction trainer there, which should actually be an easy way to get a couple of levels, and I think you can talk to her at any time. Plus, she'll take magical artifacts for sale, I'm hoping. <sighs> Alright. Yeah, the reason the game looks kind of washed out is because when I press Z, it adds a filter. Um, that's why it does. Uh, Garrett Killy, thank you very much. Alden just called. He said uh, he threw all the tea in the ocean, started rebellion in India, and now he's going after the British Empire's colonies. Well, these these things could happen if we don't save Skyrim today. If we don't stop Alden now, soon he'll start liberating people everywhere, and we can't have that. People need to be working for the Empire. As steady hands and all that, yes? They, they love to work. Right, here we go. Are you the court wizard? I want to train in destruction magic. Here we go. Bam. Train. Train me. Okay. Oh, you must level up more to train. What? You must level up to train more. Oh. I see, because I'm actually kind of high level. Um, do, 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 do. Do you have anything for sale? No, you don't have anything for Take sale. Take care of yourself. The and courier remember, must have found you. Hello. Is ripe with people Any looking to spill your blood. If you I have no idea who you are. God, I've no. I don't want to talk to you, elf. And I am oh God. The court. All right, let me go see if there's a bed to actually sleep in. After thinking, maybe I'm the dragonborn, and I just don't know it. No, you're not the dragonborn, my dude. Can I sleep in this bed, maybe? No, nope, it's owned. Um, do, 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 do. Let's go for this one over here. This bedroom's over here, right? I'm tired. Yeah, I know. I feel, I feel it, game. I feel it. I'm losing my stat. Well, I'm losing my potential max magicka, which is a problem. And also, experience gain is also lower. Ooh, rug free with the wolf queen. That's a speech in sight. Nope. All these beds are owned, right? We're going to have to leave solitude. What is it? Uh, you can place your bedroll indoors. Uh, no, I'm pretty sure it can make some NPCs hostile. Um, because you're effectively squatting. Uh, which, yeah, they're not exactly the chillest about. What's this? Just free money? I mean, I like free money, but come on, guys. And I guess I could always go try and sleep with the Khajiit caravan. Um, are there, is there a free bed here? Here we go. Here's a free bed. Thanks, guys, for leaving one open for me. That's super nice of them. Um, dude, your title of the stream irritates the people. Could you say something about this? It's print. It's read the description for Christ's sake, guys. It is the end of Skyrim. Like, we we have seven days 
to save Skyrim as it is gone for good. I've spoken to Todd. He's told me he's going to delist the entire game off of Steam. Definitely 100% trust me. Um, and yeah, the only way for that to not happen is for me to actually beat the challenge that I set myself. So what can I say? We're fighting for the future of the world, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> right, let's level up our, um, I think, stamina again. Or health. Health might say no stamina stamina is way more important um we've got a perk point to spend i don't think there's anything more we can grab in archery like we we genuinely do just have everything oh quick draw draw bow faster oh oh that could actually work that could actually work and your critical chance and critical damage with bows is doubled against enemies who fall below half health God, I'd love lethal shot. That'd be amazing. Um, Forgy doesn't look like we have that. Jeez, these people don't seem happy that I'm just sleeping here. Um, this is a terrible April Fool's joke. This isn't even an April Fool's joke. I, this is just a stream that I've had planned for weeks. Weeks, I tell you. Well, one week. Um, you fools. <sighs> Inigo needs boots. Oh, yeah, we need to give him boots. I forgot about that. Inigo... Boots. My nose enjoys this place. Are we here for business? Let me you give you something. Give me best equipment, yes? Yes, I give you the best equipment, Inigo. I always do. Um, I still can't give you anything. Even though I have taken all of the ingredients from your inventory, Inigo is genuinely just bugged. He is absolutely broken. Um, yeah, thanks, Inigo. <laughs> I can't, I can't help next? him. I'm sorry, guys. Inigo's screwed. Um, the real joke is the idea that Smith can be out and I genuinely think we can do this like I understand that to many of you this feels like a completely impossible idea however God the bards however we can do it um, because we have poison and that's all that's that's basically means we can do it hopefully um, yeah I, I believe with poison that does like a thousand damage. If we stack enough negative poison resistances against him, it should be fine. We should be able to do it. Are you going to go after another Dragon Priest? No, we just don't have time. From this point on, we're now heading towards Alduin, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to take the cart over to Whiterun, because I think that will be the... What is this? Solitude sewers? No, thank you. Um, because I think that will be the fastest way to get there in terms of time. Like, I could try and cross it myself, but... I think the time of me crossing to Whiterun will take longer than me just carriage riding. Um, also, a huge thank you to Pippin of the North for gifting 15 memberships. That's very nice of you. Oh, hello. For exploring. There are stories. Okay. Vampires, some say. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. That's... Why did you just immediately start talking to me? I don't know you. Uh, but he can one-shot you. Well, we got some extra health. We've got 50 extra health now. Um, that's pretty good. 50 health. Um, that's about it. Um, <laughs> 50 health and maybe... Uh, uh, like, the poison is good. Like, 1,400 poison is good. Extra health is good. Um, the rest is going to be pretty spicy. Um, yeah. That's going to be... That's going to be experience. Right, fair. I'd like to hire your carriage, my friend. Uh, to Whiterun, please. Have we seriously never travelled to Falkreath? I think that says a lot about Falkreath. <laughs> it's, it's just not very good, is it? It's just a pretty solid, mediocre place. Um, wouldn't he resist the poison resistance? Uh, poison on account of it being well poisoned? No. Uh, I mean, there is a chance, but I'm hoping that if we hit him with enough poison resistance, he should just die that's my hope um yeah i think it should be possible right it should definitely be possible you should try a new sky and run without upgrading your stamina on survival mode Pff, yeah but our damage is tied to our stamina so that would basically just be um suicide like there's there's no way we'd be able to survive that um right hey trader take a look what do you got for sale uh have you got any like cork bulb arrows seriously Dwarven Bow of Thunder? Yeah, it's actually not bad, but fortunately, a bit late for that now. Um, backpack of Brown Fur is useless. 
all of these resistances also useless um any crazy poisons on you virulent corrosion poison there we go this will be good 250 armor rating damage if we can make aldrin's armor damage negative then that's instantly well that's basically a multiplier in terms of damage so that's really good sleeping tree sap well i don't know if we really want that that could be a bit crazy um right let's sell me let me sell you some nonsense uh flawed vala stone i definitely don't need that sapphires don't need those flawless ruby don't need that a bunch of other rubies there you go you can have all of these garnets amethyst nonsense um that's pretty good and you're out of money so that's me done pretty good <sighs> we're doing great we're doing great okay into white run we go um it's gonna be a hell of a challenge <laughs> <laughs> I think we're going to we're gonna to have to try and hit up the Skyrim merchant and hope that she's refreshed her stock on the Canis route because if she has then that means we can have two near instant kill potions for Alduin. If she hasn't, then we've got big problems. Um, we're gonna hit up the main alchemist first because I think she can potentially train me in alchemy, which if that's the case, we might be able to pick up another perk. Um, but going. I don't know. I don't know for certain. Um, I also might swing into this the hunter shop because there's a chance that they have uh, arrows for sale that we can use. Got something for just about everybody Buy sap like drugs? With, no, no, the sap, the like moon sap stuff is crazy bad because it, it lowers our stamina, which lowers the amount of damage we can do. That dwarven bow of lethargy, orcish bow of encumbrance. <laughs> it's <laughs> yeah, we can just slow Alduin down, just make him a little bit slower in the sky. That'll do it. Uh, no, we want um, arrows. What have you got? Orcish arrows do 16 damage. Uh, Elven arrows do 14, but there's a lot more of them. Okay, we'll buy the Orcish arrows. We'll buy the Elven arrows. And we'll buy the Dwarven arrows. Just yeah, Actually, no, that that might be too heavy. But then again, we oh, we need to give an Ego arrows as well, don't we? So, yeah, let's buy a bunch of those. Um, have I got anything I want to sell you? Nope. As you wish, my fane. Oh yes, call me my fane. I forget I was a fane. Buy more net jelly. You can't buy net jelly in Skyrim. Everyone knows that. What can I do for? Got to go to like the other place for net jelly, and even then, it's like, why on earth would you? Uh, yeah, why? Why is this the end of Skyrim? Spiss retiring. He's got all the money. Yeah, I mean, have you seen the donations on this stream, guys? That's it. No more videos. I was gonna upload one this week, but. We've decided against it now that I've been given I donations. <laughs> I like training in alchemy. Uh, bam. 45. It's a lot of money, though. It only takes me up to 49. God, your teeth are weird. Um, Come back anytime if you need don't suppose... What do you got for sale? You're interested in my potions and ingredients? Uh, I've got stuff for sale. Do you want to buy... This of recovery. I don't need that. Why am I hearing someone scream in the background? Mercy. What the heck is that? Um, shouts are stronger. Don't need that. Um, I got food for sale. Oh, I failed to gather all. I can give you this. There is someone genuinely screaming I yield in the background. That's... It's poor guy. He's having a real bad day, evidently. Um... <laughs> Right. Uh, there is a chance you actually do have a really good poison. Let me double check. Potion of extra healing. No. No. God, why are you always so useless? You have, you never have anything good. Never have anything good. All right, then. All right. Back up. Oh, it's locked. Wait, why? Oh, that's the that's the wrong door. I was like, am I locked in the shop? Is this how I'm going to spend the next seven days? Um... Oh yeah, I was gonna say I need to give out. Uh, I need to give an ego armor, but um, I don't think I can. You want to talk? Um, I need to trade something with you. this will be a mutually beneficial exchange. Can I give you arrows? No. Can these are the only the only things I can give you are the things that have no weight. An ego can carry up to two hundred and twenty five stuff. <sighs> He's a smooth print. I can't help him, guys. I genuinely can't. He's just... He's scuppered. 
Paper of the North, thank you very much for your 20 US dollars to say good luck and great conquering. Teach Alduin that drinking Yorkshire tea is the only way is, is the only way to live. Um, unfortunately, it's too late for him, but we should hopefully be able to kill him. Honestly, that's just my dream. Hi, Swift. My name is Oliver. Please give my loving partner, Jody Wilkinson from Hull, a shout out, please, as she loves Skyrim too. Shout out to Jody. Well done. Um, I hope you're having a wonderful day, enjoying the world of Skyrim at home by playing it every day for Todd. Todd loves it. That's all, all he wants you to do is just play Skyrim again. Why not buy it again? Why not? It would make you happy. Young Stu, thank you very much for donating $10. Um, as the master of tea drinking, what's your opinion on loose leaf tea? I think they're quite nice, loose leaf teas. Um, quite a lot of them are very tasty. Take a look. Um, but I do still prefer Yorkshire tea. Right, have you got the crazy thing? Staff of incineration. I mean, that's pretty good. But uh, I was more talking about the ingredient. Here we go. Yes! Janin root. Oh, yes, 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 yes. That's good. That's actually really good. Um, okay. Okay, that's really good. Um, we might be able to survive with this. Let's go make this a reality. See you around. Um, also, if you received a gifted membership from Pippin of the North, of course, say thank you, which many of you are doing. That's very kind of you. Um, we're going to need to make this into a potion now, but it looks like we're going to have two Giga Murder potions, which will be really nice. Um, do, 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 do. Oh, actually, if I remember, you can train in one-handed, right? Hello, friend. Hello. Um, I like some training in one-handed weapons. Uh, you're really cheap. You must level up to train more. Oh. Am I ready to level up? I guess, do you want me to spend, like, my perk point or something? Because I don't think I am ready to level up. My alchemy is level 50. Okay, if I can get this up to Herbalist, I can then make an even stronger potion. So that's all I need to do. I need to get my... My alchemy skill up to 50, pick up that perk, and then make the Giga Potion. We can do this. <clears throat> oh, dear. Um, Blimey It's Flying donates uh, five chuff to say, I love the streams. Can you do other streams like this, or is there a petition to sign or do bribes work? Apparently, uh, most people have just been bribing me. Uh, people have just been sending in donations and saying, do more. So I guess maybe in the future we'll have to do some more. Um, I guess that appears to be what the people are after. Um, which is very nice. Uh, it, it's kind of crazy that so many people have enjoyed what we've, uh, what we've been enjoying today. Uh, right, there we go. Level 50 hit. We can quit alchemy. And now, when we go into skills, alchemy, potions you make are 50% stronger potions and poisons so now if we go for a damage health and go janin root red mountain flower 1895 damage craft pretty good that's pretty good we'll take that we will take that um fortify sneak attacks maybe 25 percent extra damage from sneak attacks that'll be great ronnie weber becomes a bloody 100 stat member Jeez, thank you very much, friend. That's exceedingly generous. And yes, I know it's like the um, CHF, if I remember, is the, it's like it's the Hungarian currency, isn't it? But I just call it Chuff. It's fun. It's CHF. Why wouldn't you call it Chuff? The currency should be called Chuff, in my opinion. If you're from the country where Chuff is the currency, then make it called Chuff. I don't know. Speak to your government. Let them know that it needs to be a thing. Is this the 100 days challenge or is it a different one? Come on, it's Chairman Meow. Of course it's the 100 days. But this is going to be the final stream. Or at least it probably should be. Um, Inigo, are you okay? Why is this dead woman? Lilith Maidenloom. What? What the hell is Lilith Maidenloom dead on the ground? What the hell happened to her? What the hell happened to her? She's dead. Who killed her? Did you kill her? Mm -hmm. Until next time. What the hell happened here? And Adriana Revenki! What? What is going on? How did these people die? Have I got the bloody zombie apocalypse mod still installed? 
Oh, there's a dead person here. Outlaw Scout. No. A scout came into the town and murdered them both? Oh my god. Oh, it's Swiss Franks. Well, rename it to Chuff, guys. Welcome to Bellathor's Jeez. Um, God Howard donates £10 to say you must stream more. Todd, our lord, demands it. Well, we'll keep Money. going, don't you worry. Let's exchange some coins. Draco. There we go. That's um, a bunch of coins. I get 283 septims. And I hand in some dwarven nonsense. And hopefully I get some septims as well. Yep, there we go. Free septims. What do you got for sale, my dude? Any great weapons? Bone arrows. Yes, I'll grab those. Um, fire arrows just don't do enough damage. Um, geez. And, yeah, nothing else that's actually useful. Okay. We can do this. We can we can definitely do this, guys. I believe in us. Um, all we've got to do is fight, you know, one of the strongest beings in the entirety of this game. Just by ourselves. <sighs> Jeez. It's going to be crazy. Toxic, thank you very much for 10 US dollars. So, Spiff, since you missed my last super chat, we the Wabberjack crew require you to use the Wabberjack as your opening attack on Aldrin. You must appease the bad guy. I can't use the Wabberjack as the opening attack. We could do a... We could do a, a sneak attack for like 400 damage and you're just like, Ah oh yes, Wabberjack him. I'm pretty sure he's like resistant to every Wabberjack, right? Like, you just can't. Oh, hello, Valent. Okay, thank you. Anigo, are you okay? You're like clutching yourself. Uh -huh. Um, and you, here, use this. Oh, I can't even give you a potion. Come on, Anigo, drink, drink extra health. This item is too heavy to carry. Anigo, you are like a smooth potato. But we make do with what we have. Present ninety nine donates twenty euros to say. Last one chance. 50 members for you if you either do, if you either unencumber an ego and give him good stuff or make him essential. He did help you so often, he deserves a break, don't you think? Is he already essential? Um, he does not seem essential. He has 97 effects currently. Oh, now I just clicked a large wooden crate somehow. <laughs> uh, do, 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 right. I don't really... I can't remember how I make someone essential. Oh, I can scroll down here, right? Oh, no, this selects different people. Inigo. Name. This is something else. This is tree shrub. Or the wall towers. Jeez, you can just individually select everything. Um, yeah, we, we can't. I mean, how do I even unencumber him? I could try and take every single thing from his inventory that weighs. Like, we'll take the bow, we'll take all of the bows, we'll take all of the ore, all of the kindling. Because we're never going to need any of this again. Okay, we'll drop all of the buckets. Well, we'll pick all of them up. Um, Iron Dagger, he doesn't need that. All of these. A sword. A bunch of linen wraps. I can't remember how we ended up with those. Right, there we go. Can I give you stuff? Nope, still can't give him anything. Literally can't give him anything. This guy. Oh my god, right. Orcish bow, you're pretty good. Dwarven bow is better, though, if I remember correctly. Got a bunch of staffs as well. Um, let me drop the rubbish. Firewood, linen wraps, deer hide, whetstone. Actually, can I use this? No. All right, we can drop that as well. Uh, do, 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 do. All of these. Oh, I dropped an ebony ingot, which I definitely shouldn't have done, but oh well. Might need the kindling just in case we need a fire. Are you leaving YouTube? No, this is the end of Skyrim. Skyrim is dying unless I can somehow defeat Alden in about six days' time. Um, oh, God. 
It's okay. time for us to part ways. If you need backup, I will be in my cell. Right, okay. I'm hoping if I dismiss him... Okay, there you go. You're dismissed. Now, Hello, my friend. follow me. I need your help. Yes, we will fight side by side again. Right. Greetings. And then... Um, I okay. need you... Good to oh. see you. Follow me, I need your help. Yes, you missed me, didn't you? Please, does that mean you're my follower? Something on your mind? Here we go, yes, good. I, I need to trade something with you. Gladly. Please tell me it's fixed. It's still not fixed. Enigo, you useless cat! <sighs> is Enigo injured? He is injured. Oh, is that why I can't give him anything? Okay. Is that a debuff? Let us get back to it. I think it is, I you're right. You, my friend. I think you're What's right. Next? It's completely, um, because he's injured, I can't probably give him a new item for, like, several days, right? Which would explain. I think he's injured for about, like, six more days. Um, does it tell me how long he is injured for? God, look at all of these fortify archeries I have going. And yet I still feel completely like a peasant. Um, oh, jeez. Right, uh, let's go up and try and defeat Alduin. Now, he is currently up there. Ooh! I need a fast travel kit, right? I reckon we can we can buy one, right? The um to be able to fast travel up there. What do you want? Do I want? Oh no, he's grumpy. Uh -huh. Um, because we can't fast travel unless we have. Got uh, the a, in all the I think no. Ride strong. Or do we just try and ride up the hill? We it's no, it's way too far strong. up there. But it is beautiful. It's too, too high. Um, order to pick up potion. Uh, I mean, I can try and get him to pick it up, but I don't think that's going to work because there's a lot of patches that have gone into this. Uh, do, 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 do. Have we got the fast travel? There we go, travel pack. Required to fast travel. There we go, that's all we need. We can take the travel pack up to High Rothgar, climb the way to the throat of the world, fight Alduin. Or we could just fast travel up to the throat of the world. Is there no magic to heal him? Um, well, let me check what magic I have access to. I can conjure skeleton. Oh my god, I finally have enough magic to conjure a skeleton. Wow. We're leveling up, Inigo. We're doing great. Yes, my friend. But yeah, that's all I can do. I don't have any other magic. And it takes time to learn magic, which basically means we're never doing that. Okay, we need Dragon Rend. I remember that, because we have to bring him down immediately. And then... Oh my god. This is actually crazy. Um, let's unlock these. We might as well unlock Throat Voice as well. Roll and Sprint, we can do that. Storm Cool. There we go. Um, geez. This is going to be crazy. Um, bone bury the skeleton. Can't you heal his skeleton? I can't do anything. I can just summon skeleton. Which I guess... Actually, what if you if you summoned a skeleton inside of someone? You're right. Surely that would just heal their bones. Also, why don't, why don't conjuration people use that as their special power? Like, why do you bother summoning a skeleton? to fight for you when you could just summon a, a skeleton inside the matter of someone else and then they'd be split in half as like a, a skeleton formed inside of them and their body would just explode logically that's the best way to use conjuration magic that's thinking outside the box we have six points three six days to beat the game oh my god this is going to be um Quite a lot, indeed. Uh, Chris Xu says, um, I think those two ladies fall in love with the same guy, the Scout, uh, so they fought to the death and also killed the man, the Scout. I mean, that's entirely possible. That makes sense why the Outlaw Scout is dead. It was quite a hell of a fight, evidently. Um, Alex Wind says, Love the stream. My first donation to a stream ever. Love your content. Thank you, Alex Wind. And Obel Foxall says, Can't believe I'm finally catching a spiff stream. I missed the one a couple of weeks ago due to work. Got my friend... Uh, to love Yorkshire tea, thanks to me. Well, that's a very good thing. Well done. Thank you for spreading the cult of tea. Hello there as well. Thank you very much for donating. Say, would you play uh, a game that is actually called British Empire Simulator that isn't a total war game? 
Um, I mean, it is quite funny. The closest British Empire simulator is like EU4, which is very entertaining, in my opinion. Um, phew, blimey, it's flying. Says if Alduin wins, you've got to do 100 days again. <laughs> Piss off. You can't make me do that. Also, geez, almost 4,000 likes on the stream. That's crazy. And thank you very much to JDog6677 for donating $50 to say we believe in you. Thanks, JDog. I... I struggle to believe in me, but we might be able to do this. Um, right, let's get everything equipped. Um, we need we need the ebony bow. We need. Actually, although Darwin's bow is just better, I know Inigo's bow technically has an enchantment on it, but it's just I don't think it is quite as good. Let's drop this on the ground, actually, and see if we can get Inigo to pick it up. You want to Inigo, I need you to do what something. You have me do? How um, can, I help you, my friend? can you take this? Come, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. He can! Okay. Chat, you're right. We've got around it. We can exploit Inigo's broken carry weight. Um, you that one that likes to coat their weapon in poison, aren't you? Yes. Until next time. What? Oh my god, I thought I was about to just get murdered by a guard. What the hell was that about? <laughs> Jeez. Um, let's drop 120 dwarven arrows on the ground. Um, Inigo, on your mind? I need to what do something. Do? Um, do if I can. Pick that up. Yes, Inigo. Moving out. Okay, have we got like healing potions maybe? Um, potion of mending? No, that, I don't think that's going to help actually. Uh... Do, 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 do. Have I got, like, armor? Yes, we can finally give him some boots, right? And I don't have any boots in my inventory. <laughs> Gladys, what armor do you have? We, we're finally able to equip an ego. Um, elven light boots. There we go. That's not bad. And minor marksman helmet we can give to him. Um, and this scaled armor, I think, is also better. Right, we'll do all of this. There we go. We're, we're, le we're leveling him up, guys. He might be over the weight limit, but it doesn't matter. We're going to make him good. Okay, we drop that and this. Okay, and you go. Mm -hmm. What would you have me do? What would I have you do, my friend? Please pick up this. Whatever you say. Please pick up this. Will be done. Please take good this. Idea. Now put it on. And don't attack Gladys. Let us move on. Gladys, I think you're standing on... Is he still not going to wear it? Uh -huh. Okay, fine. Let's go. Okay, I can't, I can't help him. I tried. <laughs> there should be a resurrection spell that lets you target uh, leather or fur armor to resurrect the animal used to make the armor. Now that's true power. Present 99, my friend. Thank you for 50 gifted memberships. That's actually insane. Right. I think this is going to be the fight. Um... We're, we're in a good position. We're going to do extra damage with ranged. We've got our earrings in. Um, we do extra damage with sneaking. Uh, let's get frost resistance increased. Yeah, let's get frost resistance boost up. Uh, we've got a, just a silver garnet ring on. We can do better than that. Frost resistance is increased by 33%. Yes. Um, that will actually be a pretty big buff. Um... And then we'll do the Ring of Archery rather than another Frost Resistance. But yeah, that's actually not bad at all. Um, the Lowered Hood, so we do extra damage with ranged weapons. Increase your magic resistance by 25%. Do we want to maybe wear this instead? I mean, what's the armor we're wearing? White Run Fane armor, increase light armor skill by 10 points. And it is 167 armor. So... Yeah, I mean, the armor differential is quite big. But I'm I'm just considering that maybe if we can get magic resistance high enough, like, are we going to be able to resist Alduin entirely? Because it's 25% magic resistance there, 10% resistance there. Um, frost resistance is 33%, 5% there. Reduced uh, minor combat stress, we can fix that. Um, standing stone, so we do extra damage with sneak attack. 
Khajiit Ancestry. Uh, that's Stamina Boost. Okay, this is... Um, Jeez, yeah. Maybe you have a magic resistance one on you? Let me you check. Sure. What can I do for well, you? Also, thanks for gifting uh, what is it that you need? everyone uh, memberships. Me That's know. really nice. That's else? really, really kind. What can I, do for you? I need to trade something with you, Bailrand. Of course. Have you got Chris's gloves, Chris's robes, Chris's boots? Um, Vulcan. No, that just reduces spells. Movement speed, magic is increased, stamina is increased. Arm rate is increased by 100, and your health regeneration is increased by 50%. Um, no, not quite as good. Okay. Right. Jeez, this is going to be um, this is going to be a hell of a fight. Let me know if you need anything. Uh, oh, I believe in it. How many days of prep work will you do? Uh, we've done a couple of days of prep work, and I'm just conscious of the fact that we do kind of need to throw ourselves at him. Um, as I'm not too sure there's much more I can do. Um, outside of maybe trying to level up once more to get another perk point. But let me see, if what would I be able to put another perk point into, basically? That's my question. Um, because archery is always good, but the only other thing we can grab is the ability to draw the bow faster, which would increase DPS output and also our ability to uh, do potions more. So, yeah, actually, let's see if we can level up one more time. Um, can you trade me in anything? Oh, that's 360. Um, no, you're pretty useless. What about you? Useless? Can you trade me in sneak? Here we go. I've already learned everything. Okay, fine. Off we go. Uh, you can make armor from robes on tanning rack. Thank you so much. Let's give that a try, Shark with Laser. Because then at least I can get a bit of um, I can bit of get a bit of armor on me. Uh, why is Skyrim looking so good? It's uh, it just is. Can you get that mage girl follower? Unfortunately, not. Um, it's gonna take several days for her to um, to basically become. Let me grab some of this stuff just in case. Uh, it's gonna take several days for her to be able to be uh, recruited, which basically means she's useless. Um, because I think she's gonna take too long. Uh, Ac. Act20R in chat says, I bought your Ktiba because of this guy. It's nice to know that I've had an effect. Um, does Archer even affect crossbows? It can. No, it some do, fights. some don't. But yeah, we're not going to be using the crossbow on the final fight. Um, right. Am I able to turn the cloves into... I don't think I am. Nope, I don't think I am able to. I can make ebony rings, but that generally looks like it's it. Yeah, it's kind of like Vulcan's armor is the only thing I can do. Um, and that costs way too much. Um, yeah. Yep, yeah, all of this is too expensive. <sighs> we can't use it, but that's okay. Now oh, people are screaming because of the body. Just leave the bodies alone, guys. Come on, let your kids ignore them. Um, I know we can train up. Uh, oh, you can. Can you train can me up you? anymore? I can teach you a few things. No, you can't. You must level up to train more. Oh, I'm only allowed to. I'm only allowed to train five times per level up across all trainers. Oh, jeez. Do the Balgraf Assassin quest. The bow you get is great and turns you invisible. Honestly, I think we might have to. It's a really dumb and simple quest line, but I think it's our best bet because it it would give us a leveled bow that potentially is better than our current bow. So yeah, we'll do it. Um, it's a classic one. Uh, I think Inigo put the armor on. I don't think he did. It's hard to tell. Um, really is. Are you? Oh, you're an elf. Oh. Let's go. All right. What can I do for you? You're pretty useless. Let me speak to the steward. Oh, hello. 
He's a great mime, isn't he, Mr. Preventus? Hello. Is there anything you need from me? Of course. It's all in this note. It's all in this note. Here we go. Steward's note. In the shadows, the quest is started. Um, read the steward's note. Uh, do, 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 do. Where is it? Steward's note. Someone is trying to assassin. Go take a look at Arcadius Cauldron. You should talk to the Jarl up in Dragon's Reach. Lend any aid you can. Uh, can I actually disenchant stuff? Because that could give me a level up as well. Um, quit alchemy, please. Uh, there was a, suge a suggestion in chat. Make Inigo pick up a bow and then take away his bow. He may re-equip everything. Oh, there's a chance that could work, actually. Ooh, am I able to make a fortify resist frost? 33%. Yes, if I move to make like a, a silver sapphire ring, fortify frost resistance. Use the uh, the black soul gem. Craft. I might be able to get 100% frost resistance from this. Um, do, 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 do. Uh, whereabouts are you? Yes, here we go. Frost resistance, 15% from you. But, do, 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 do. This one here, frost resistance, 33%. So we are now up to about 66% frost resistance. Was there a magic resistance one, just a flat magic resistance? Because if there was, that was a bit silly. Um, no, I don't think there was. Resist disease. Yeah, there really wasn't. Okay, that's fine. Back up we go. Uh, pick up a bow. You want me to get Anigo to pick up a bow? Right. Let me see if we can do that. Anigo... There is... Oh, I can't drop this bow, can I? Um, we can have him pick up the crossbow, I guess. Because I don't think I'm going to be using that anymore. So, in you go. Mm -hmm. I need to what do something. You do? Could you please pick up friend? this? Hey, hands off. Oh, shit. Hey, that was stealing. Okay, lead the way. You have committed I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Take 700 gold. We lost some time on that, didn't we? No, we lost time! Did we? What time is it? What day? What day? I don't think we even lost the bow as well. Well, the crossbow. Damn it, I forgot it was stolen. I forgot it was stolen. 6.2, okay. We didn't lose any time. And Ego does still have the crossbow. And it's on his back, so that looks like he's equipped it. Um. Yes, my friend. What is yours is mine. Oh my god. Um. Can I give you stuff now? No, I still can't. Oh well. We gave it a really good try. Let's go try and... Uh, let's do this quest line. Yes, uh, have Inigo touch the shrine to heal him. Okay, fine. We can give this a try. I don't really know if it's going to actually help him that much. Hey, Inigo. Inigo. Oh no, that's Belrand. Inigo, hello. I need to do something. Come, activate this. Go on, Inigo, go. Is he walking really slowly round to activate the shrine? Yes, he is. Oh. Thank you, Trolls, by the way, uh, for donating Krona to say, Danish Krona to say, Godspeed, Mr. Spiff. I, I believe in myself. Also, thank you very much for the 4,400 people. Oh, it's 4,420. It's 420. Thank you for liking the stream. That's very nice of you. Anigo. Let us move on. Right, Anigo. I need to do something. What would you have me do? I would have you activate the shrine of Talos. Okay, he can't do it. He can't activate the shrine. Fine, that's a discovery. He's really taking his time. Guys, do you have any idea how much life Alduin has? I need to take every single advantage I can have. Um, hello, I need... Actually, I need to find the... Where's the ledger? Um, it's upstairs, right? Excuse me. Oh, here's the ledger. Read the business ledger copy. Um... Do, 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 do. Business ledger copy, blah, 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 blah. Uh, investigate Hall of the Dead and check the stables. Uh, it's the stables, basically. We know where the guy is. 
I've done this questline before. Uh, I don't suppose you get another follower. I don't think I can. I mean, I guess I could try. I mean, what, there's Janassa is in there. Oh, wait, no, Janassa's dead. Sorry, I forget. Um, a lot of the possible Skyrim followers have already died in this journey. Um, hello there, it donates two pounds to say 42069, 42069, 42069, and 42069. Highly original and glorious. <laughs> Thank you, by the way, Crimson Cap, for your donation. That's very generous of you. 200 kroner. Um, Spiff, your chat wants you to pick up the pace before Gladys dies from your decision to take a stroll. I'm genuinely doing my best. Like, this questline is probably our last hope of getting a bow that can actually counter Alduin. Like, we've done a good job. We've got huge amounts of resistance to his damage type. Um, so from here on out, it's basically, oh, this stuff's still on the ground. And you go, mm -hmm. I need to do something. What would you have me do? Um, Please put on these boots. Oh, you have them on. <gasps> They've duplicated. You've got this helmet on as well. We item duped, ladies and gentlemen. Skyrim is a perfectly balanced game. Skyrim is a perfectly balanced game. Someone in chat says Alduin has 2,355 HP. This person has not played this mod pack before. <laughs> Don't listen to them. <laughs> Alduin has several thousand experience. Yep, yeah, wow, it actually did just duplicate the item. That's crazy. Um, yeah, uh, no, Alduin has a lot of HP. Right, here we go, here's this man. Uh, he has the spell to move Detect Life, by the way, which is really good. Um, it's super powerful, because you can fast level Conjuration up off of it. But of course we don't have time. Um, what was the note again? Uh, do, 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 do. Note on, no, not this. Not this either. Um, not this either. Uh, stable hands note. Here we go. Uh, bam. Something, something, something. Silent Moon's camp. Investigate the Silent Moon's camp. Horsey, please. Don't back me into a corner. Right. Silent Moon's camp is... Let me check my map. Over there. We've already cleared it. So we just need to investigate it. Uh, let me check the journal. In the shadows. Okay. We can do this. We're doing great. Uh, is it the game or the Spiff and Grit doing the breaking? Uh, this today is definitely more me. This game has been patched so much now that it's actually not terrible. Um, but I'm doing some very dastardly things to it. Alduin has at least 5 HP. Okay, listen to Devnull in chat. They're incredibly intelligent. Um, they, <laughs> they know what they're talking about. Alduin does indeed have at least 5 HP. Uh, sources are saying this to be true. I also believe this to be true. Uh, but yeah, he has uh, he has about he should have around about five thousand health. He should be regenerating two health per second. He should have about a sixty percent resistance to magic is what should remain. Um, and so yeah, he's going to be a tough fight, but I reckon we can still do it. Oh, there's the sword in the sea, but it's now an orcish sword because we're late game, so it's actually pretty powerful. Uh, oh, hello. There's just a deer. I don't think there are any bandits, because we cleared this out, so they're probably all dead. Although they might respawn for the quest line, I'm not sure. Uh, Spiff needs bolts for crossbow. No, I've given bolts to an ego, although he doesn't seem to want to use the crossbow. He's looking quite good. Um, you can get a lot of followers from mods uh, at the same time. Gore and Ori outside Falkreef, Remy and Markov and Karna outside Riverwood, and Lucian in Falkreef are all able to be had simultaneously. Okay, so Falkreef has like three followers, you're telling me. Well, I mean, I kind of want to cheese the game, so maybe that's for the best. Um, where do I need to go in here again? Is it the interior or is it up at the top for the quest? I think it could be up at the top. Um, will the individual streams appear as a whole video? Uh, yes, they probably will. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's a good thing we cleared this out earlier. Makes my life easier. Right, Assassin's Journal. Find the Assassin on the upper floor. Oh. Why am I hearing a bear? Oh, ebony arrows. They sound good. 20 damage. Only thing's better is a bone arrow, of which, how many do we have? Seven. Okay, that's not much. 
Um, right, back we go. I can also hear a bear, but yeah, let's go save the, um, let's go save the Yarl's life. I uh, don't think he picked them up unless it duped too. Yeah, he did, um, he did pick up the items, and then they also duped, because it's Skyrim. And sometimes there's sequencing breaks between, um, uh, between what the game is seeing and the game is doing. Hello, Mr. Crab. Look at this. Common mud crab. 250 HP. Look at that. A silly little guys. Little silly little goobers. But I think I also have stamina absorption on stuff that's nearby, which is pretty funny. But yeah. Not too bad. Oh, Nigo's looking good. Look at him go. Good job, Nigo. Well played, everyone. We did a great job fighting those mud crabs. Oh, great. And Inigo and Barrand are fighting each other again. Let's try and reset this with a quick save. And a quick load. This is the problem with having a mage in your party, okay? The mages friendly fire like nobody's business, which is a big problem. A uh, very big problem for me. Right, come on. Can you two stop fighting? Fine, Inigo. You just keep messing up. I swear, if Inigo kills him, we have real big problems. Because I don't think Inigo can die. It's hard to tell. He seems pretty powerful. I'm just hoping that me being far enough away stops their combat. So I'm just going to keep running. Um, Gladys needs some help. No, Gladys is fine. She just woofs all the time. Uh, she's also immortal, technically. There's a horsey out here. Is this like a horsey I'm meant to tame? Or a horsey I'm... Oh, there's a saber cat. Oh, 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 oh. oh, Mr. Sabercat is dead. Oh, there's a second Sabercat. There's a, there's a second Sabercat. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. Gladys, yes. Thank you, Gladys. Thank you, Gladys, so much. Okay, big attacks. No, no. Ooh, 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 no, Mr. Sabercat. You don't need to come over here, Mr. Sabercat. We're actually... We're actually doing quite okay. We're doing quite okay without the friendship. Okay, okay, jump, 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 no, 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 no. Yes, there we go. That was a hit. That was a hit. Right, come on, come on, at me, Mr. Saber Cat. Then, bam, nailed it. Oh my God! Thank you, Gladys. Oh. Yeah, Inigo and Gladys were fighting last week. Yeah, I don't know why Inigo just gets really grumpy. Here comes an ego. Please tell me that our other follower is also coming an ego. Yes, my friend. And that you if didn't just kill him. Else, just ask. Because if you killed our one companion, then that's going to be a really annoying thing when we go and have to f fight bloody Aldwin. Ah, oh, dear. Right. Um. What time is it? Uh, do, 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 do. It is 7 p.m. So most of the shops are closing. I think we, if, if we can have all these followers from Falkreef, we can try and pick them up. Oh, hello, Sword. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Okay, thank you, Mr. Career Man. He's very nice, very kind. <laughs> oh my goodness, we're almost at 5,000 likes on the stream. Thank you very much, guys. Why is this the last stream? Because we only have six days left to defeat, beat Skyrim. And if we don't, that's Skyrim over. The world will end. Quite literally, Alden wins. So, yeah. That's why we have to we have to do well. Right. It said at the top that Belran needs some help. Well, if he teleports, he's alive. There you go. I was going to say if he teleports in, then it's okay. If he doesn't, then he's dead. So we got lucky. He's still alive. Uh, but yeah, literally everyone can die in this game, as you can tell by the fact that there's corpses at the front door. Um, yeah, let's make our way up to the palace. We do have to defeat this uh, this assassin, which is going to be a little bit challenging, but we do have a few advantages. Namely, my shout of not dragon rend, but um, do 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 do. Where is it? Powers. Hunter's sight should give me the ability to um, uh, to detect this man hiding. Oh. So if we would like your mod list or even a mod pack. It's do you guys not even read the descriptions of YouTube videos anymore? Like what's going on? It's always right there. 
it's always right there. Right, let's get some poison on this as well. This guy shouldn't be powerful, so... Um, yeah, this virulent poison should do fine. Right, so there should be an assassin up to the top right, if I remember correctly. Yeah, he's up there. Alright, let's try and make our way over. Do 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 Dead! Yes! That's more like it! Oh, yes. Instant one-hit shot. What have you got? Bow of Shadows. 80 damage. Weapon draw is 20% faster and casts invisibility for 30 seconds. That actually seems pretty good. Let's grab all these ebony arrows. Stamina poison is not useful. Magehood, all of this is useless. I see you. Okay. Where did you go, my friend? That's pretty good. And Ego, let's actually give you your bow back. Because um, I'm pretty sure this is going to be better. Yeah, it does more damage. Um, so, Anigo's bow. Anigo, mm -hmm. I need you to do something. What would you have me do? You can have this back. I can. Oh, you got some incredible, incredible tips from the chat. The Mad Dane says, "Remember, friendly fire isn't, and this is the best tip that you've ever seen." So that's incredibly useful, guys. Just in case you need that information in your life. Where is the steward? Speak to the Yarl steward. Where the hell are you? He's up on the second floor. Yeah, he is. All right, up we go. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Where are you? Prevent us. Give me my money. I saved the Jarl. The Jarl is... As I found the assassin and took care of him. 1,250 gold. Very nice. Um, I could buy some a house in the city, so but that kind of seems useless. <laughs> oh, dear. Wouldn't stamina affect Aldrin, Aldrin's flight time? No, because you need Dragon Ren to bring him down. Stamina doesn't really have an effect on him. Um, yeah. That's all I, I know. Uh, oh, hi, Spiff. I heard a rumor you boil your water in the microwave. No. If you were to try and boil water in the microwave, you'd break the mug. Uh, this is why we in the UK invented kettles. Uh, electric kettles where you fill up with water, push a button, and then... After literally no time, you just have hot water. It's really is that simple, guys. It it doesn't. It's not like groundbreaking stuff. It's it's just kind of known. It's really easy. All right, we don't need ebony arrows highlighted, uh, but bow of shadows is good. We might even be able to improve this ourselves. I'm not sure. Um, Your current lack of a body right. is disconcerting. Let's go for. Uh, we do need to sort out our poison. So deadly poison and deadly poison plus one need to be favorited. This doesn't because we can just drink that before we fast travel up. This also needs to be favorited. And then probably also... Um, uh, stamina potions need to be favorited. Uh, draft of extra stamina? No, we just kind of need to go for extreme stamina, don't we? Uh, I suppose this is good as well. But we'll drink that before we start the fight. This is good. We'll need that. Okay. Boiling an electric kettle as we speak for coffee? How dare you, one mad apple! Alright, find that man in chat, guys, and, and burn him. I was going to say burn him, but no, ban him. <laughs> I think I'll get banned if I say the other one. Um, Smith, it's 2024. Indeed it is. We know that. Do you have the Yorkshire tea mod installed? No, I don't. It's really overpowered, so I can't. I'm sorry. Buff the bow. I don't think... Oh, yes! I can put two enchantments on something, can't I? Right, well, first let me see if I can grindstone it. Bow of Shadows, Ebony Ingot. There we go. Craft it. 97. That's pretty good. That's pretty good indeed. Um, let's find that enchantment table, actually. Got to go right the way back up. I uh, just got here. Can someone catch me up to speed? Okay, so for the last 40 or so hours of streaming, I've been playing Skyrim 100 days. Uh, there, I have a hundred days to beat the main quest of Skyrim, else at the end there is a cutscene where Alduin destroys the entire world and we can no longer play on it, and everyone dies. Uh, not good. Um, the solution is, of course, to defeat Alduin, uh, but there's about 1,200 mods loaded on, which makes that quite challenging indeed. Um, yeah, 
Oh, Connor's just used the slash ban command on that guy. I suppose I should have been more specific. Um, someone says I'll give 500 US dollars if Spiff admits coffee is better. Well, I mean, surely I, I would just say, oh, yeah, coffee's better, and then just immediately go, but I didn't say that. There you go, simple as that. There you go. I don't agree with that. <laughs> right, let me dis let me uh, unequip it. Um, also, coffee isn't better, by the way. It, it's pretty darn obvious. Like, it's pretty bad. 100 in-game days, not 100 real ones. Yep, 100 in-game days, which is still an insane amount of time. Um, you can't enchant a bow that's already enchanted. Uh, we can. We can give a bow. We can give items multiple enchantments. I think it's something we learned. Maybe. I can't remember if we actually picked that up. Um, do, 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 do. Right, let's just make some restore stamina potions, I guess. I said this is restore stamina, but this just deals five magical damage. <laughs> like, come on, give me, give me some stamina. Right, bam, 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 bam. Targets are silence. Targets are silence. Targets are silence. No, I just wanted to restore stamina, guys. <laughs> oh dear. Right, there we go. Bunch of restore stamina potions. We can't improve the bow anymore. I guess we we have to travel over to Falkreath now and um, then see if we can. Uh, that's going to be a clip. No, it's not. We're just going to delete everyone who makes that clip. Um, yeah, we've probably got to travel over to Falkreef and see if we can pick up these uh, these people that are suggested. Because that could probably actually be really useful. Could use another drink. There we go. Don't feel stressed anymore. Oh, chat, how many days left? I don't want to miss the end. Um, I'll show you, Juve. We have... Six, exactly. And, of course, if I die, that comes closer. So, yeah. Every time I die, I lose a day. It's the classic classic trick, and it feels feels rough. feels really rough. But, yeah, we have about 5.9 days. I'm going to fast travel. Well, not fast travel. I'm going to have to take the cart to Falkreef. And that's going to eat up some time. But apparently you guys say I can get companions out of this, so that's what we're going to do. Um, Chris donates 12.55 US dollars to say, Been a fan and watching since your Fable video for the unlimited gold exploit glitch. Uh, why did Derek have to be such a Derek? Sorry, it's not much. Keep up on the amazing content. D you say it's not much, but $12 donation is insane. I play video games for a living. Like, it's wild that people enjoy my work in the first place. Um, but seriously, without you guys being such ridiculously generous sausages and turning up every day to watch my videos and give them likes and engage with them in the comment section, yeah, we wouldn't be able to do this. But thanks to you, I have, like... You're, you're helping support me live my life. You're helping pay for the wages of, like... Five different, well, actually probably about seven different people at the moment. It's a big team it's currently. And as a result, yeah, we're doing some pretty cool stuff. Um, right, uh, I'd like to hire the carriage. Falkreath. The one hold we haven't visited, which actually does feel, it feels like it makes sense. Before the end, we should see Falkreath. How much is there left to do? I mean, Aldrin's at the top of the mountain. He's literally up there at the moment. Um... So yeah, we're not doing too bad. Oh, right, who are the people I meant to um I meant to pick up? Did you see a dog? Did I see a dog out there? No. Oh well, I guess I'll stay on the lookout. Cool, thank you, guard man. Falkreef guard. Is it, Kaji? Damn, you look crazy. Sorry, this Falkreef guard's armor versus this one. This is like you versus the guard she told you not to worry about. <sighs> oh, jeez. This place looks crazy cool. Right, who am I meant to hire? Okay, that's nice. That's kind of racist. What can I do for you, stranger? Um, you look strong. Um, have you ever thought of leaving Falkreef? A place where we have good jobs. Need help with There's anything? Some sort of trouble in Falkreef. But a local oh. warlord has raised the stakes. Okay, no, you're kind of useless. Bolland. I like to. I like to buy some lumber. No, okay, right. I probably I... can't hire you. Um, maybe in the inn, I guess. Go get Barbus. Oh, the immortal what dog. Where even is Barbus? The well, then we'd have two dogs following us. But that is actually a good idea because Barbus is kind of overpowered, right? Got to thinking. Maybe I'm the dragonborn. No, you're not. Don't know it yet. No, you're just you're not. Your bones, handsome man in Falkreath. Thank you very much. Of of oh dear, 
I'm sorry. Are you here for a funeral? No. Oh, yes, actually. I recently lost someone important to me. Come to the right. If you need a bed, speak to Volga. She'll set you right. If you need anything else, just let me know. Okay, thank you very much. Aye. Lovely. Right. Is there anyone else? Uh, is there a man I can hire? You look kind of hireable. I Lucian? Do this, but, yes. Um, have you got a moment? Yeah, of course. My name is He's a scientist, Blood. philosopher, amateur I wizard. Help noticing that you seem... Yes. As a matter of... I find the trouble is I'm really not Skyrim's no place for a milk drinker like me. I suppose what I'm asking. Okay, this man wants to travel along with me. Tag along? I will of course compensate. Oh, shall we say three hundred septims? Three hundred septims. There we go. After that, I'll top you up every time with at your discretion. Okay, fantastic. No obligations. Okay, right. We picked up Lucian. This is fine. This is going to be quite the adventure. Okay. Right, right, so we've got one. How can I assist? Oh, you're a scholar. They got for sale. Oh, just a bunch of nonsense. Okay, you're a bard. You're useless. What about you? You're an adventurer and you're racist. Belrand, you're mine already. Ah. What? Jesus Christ! <laughs> the messages I could say is you'll face me like a soldier, Falva. What the hell? Uh, actually, I just wanted to talk. Perhaps you wish to discuss both. Um, sure, let's... Why bother with the foreplay? You s well, you were too late. I am no longer a Thalmor. The clothes are just that. Clothes. Uh, okay. A peculiar position to take, seeing that I have no... If you are an enemy of the Thalmor, then I am no longer against you. Um, Regardless, we are in no way in league with each other. Why come to Falkreath? It is a... T my plan is to right, return on, to the Somerset in? Isle after doing a little sightseeing. Uh, it does have its yes, charm. Yes, I have noted. The humour does not extend to the barracks or the cemetery, however. Okay, I guess I just maybe go for all of this. I was Unfortunately, myself and one of the other justiciars got into an argument over the children. The fool thought they were innocent. Ah, uh, of course. It is futile. The issue was made irrelevant, however, when the entire family was found murdered. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> There's nothing. The last one. I, think I have no idea who this woman is. Yes, but, this um, is after I told you. Of course. The Thalmor are not talked. Although... I suggest you don a helmet in advance. One of those dwarven ones, unless his response. But Hammerfell no proves that some actual person is. will never yield. And when this war resumes, rest assured there will be no attempts made upon your drink. Jesus Christ. They are tolerant because, as such, here. Come on. <sighs> I couldn't tell the yell you said that. Go ahead. Come on. Come on. Most surely believes. Jesus Christ. Okay. That is, moreover, this, is this person useless? Can I even hire this person? Is this just a scam? I confess to the crime, but I was stripped of my rank and exiled. <laughs> By whom? On Dol I don't know if that's true, but I wouldn't doubt his Okay, this person is meaningless. I thought I could hire them, but I can't, it would seem. Um, so yeah, we're just going to leave him be. But that's fine. We've still got a couple people. Uh, where's Barbus, though? She has nothing going on. Okay. Ugh. Citus Alcorf. Jesus Christ! Hundred dollar donation. Yay, I finally caught a stream. Now let the exploiter YouTube extort my hard-earned money with such a glorious stream of Skyrim. Welcome, friend. Uh, you can't recruit her. Okay, thanks, chat. Um, yeah, she just seems like a grumpy elf. Oh, we got Lucian now, though. Hey, Lucian. Um, something on your mind? Uh, I need to trade some things with you. Go ahead. Load me up. You've got an iron sword. I can at least give you, say, a fur backpack. There you go. That's pretty good. Uh, you can have this hood. Um, you can have this ring, I guess. And this thing. And um, uh, the Fane armor, I guess. Yeah, you can have the Fane armor. That will keep you alive for a while. Um, what about weapons? Uh, I can give you... Ooh! And give you the staff, right? 12 poison damage. Let's give you the both staffs. There we go, you can become the staff man. Um, and you can even have this little dagger. Okay, no, that's a quest item. But hey, that's pretty good. I've given you some stuff. All right. Lucian's looking 
Okay. Um, right, where is Barbus? Barbus can be found west of Falkreef along the road beyond the fork. Okay, well, let me check my map. Um, also, we don't accept west. Uh, it's actually west. So this is north, east, south, and west. So what is the west exit of Falkreef? Um, oh, this way is... This way is... Uh, that's north. That's east. This is west. So let's go west. There we go. I've done it. Oh, all right. Um, let's go find this dog, I guess. Oh, well, literally equipping the bow makes me invisible. That's pretty good. Not not half bad. Potentially be able to use that. Um, do 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 do. Uh, Ori of is north of uh, northwest of Falkreef inside a giant pod. Gore is southeast behind a rock. Uh, up the mountain towards Bruma. Oh, southeast is quite a trek away though. Um, northwest we could probably do. All right. Which which direction is the dog on the fork? Is the dog to the left or to the right? Um, I can't remember. Uh, give the duplicate armors. Oh, I suppose we could do, but does he have a bow on? No, we're just going to give him the staffs, right? Also, hey, HG boss. Um, now everyone's just saying snout weast. Um, forget the dog, get Ari, she's great. Okay, fine, let's go south weast. No, north weast. This is north weast of White Run, right? Yes, this is north weast area. Ari is behind a rock. I mean, that doesn't really help, I've got to be honest. Behind a rock northwest of Whiterun. Like, there's the graveyard. Playing with no map? No, no, we are playing with a map. It's just I have no idea where I'm on it. Uh, there's the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. Um, are they, like, maybe... Maybe over here? There's some rocks here. So if I think that stay in shape is in spells, it allows you to do push-ups. You're not 100% certain, though. Yes, it is. Exercise, warm up, and build muscle. That's pretty fun. Good find. Let's me do some push-ups. Fun. Um, they may be in here. This kind of looks like a, a place. Okay, there's a, there's a thing in here. Roadside ruins discovered. Male high elf. There's a dryad. Oh, it can see me. We did a good bit of damage, though. And it's dead. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. That's a dead dryad. Lots of dead people, though. Jeez. Well, I thought potentially we would have a companion person in here, but nope. Seemed not to be the case. Just a bunch of dead bandits. Um, do, 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 do. Um, whereabouts is... Oh, my goodness. Uh, Ori is in a pod northeast of Falkreef. So here's Falkreef. We're here currently, so that's northeast. What do you mean by pod? Pod. Pod. What is this? Living being floating around here somewhere. Okay, I feel like this is more northeast, because what? 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 Oh my god! From what? Fight of a pack of wolves? What? Why? What? Ah! Ah! Oh my god! Be careful, guys! Do we do great? Do we win? Is this the person we're meant to save? Hi, Karna. Excuse me. Two nights spent waiting in the trees for the vermin to show. Oh, do you have a death wish? Hmm? What are you doing here? I didn't uh, save your hide for my amusement. That hello. is Hello. I was trying to find you. Half the if wasting both our time was your goal, then stupid Lowlander. What? The question is what you are doing. It. <laughs> it's what is you this are, the person? Not you and all the people in these lands. You have lost yourselves. Oh Unable. Jesus, sure person is just blabbering on. Not be the one um, to guide you down the path. Um, this life suits me just fine. <laughs> Thank you very much. But I ask again. What uh, I spoke with Land the Lungbreton. You saved. I do not know that. I have no idea who Land is. 
He was babbling away, sitting on the ground. Oh, this is. Oh my God! This is from the first the stream. This is this is from the guy in Riverwood, we, who we found, and he was like, "Wow, it was saved by Karner, a big brave warrior." That was him. Yes, he had some interesting things to say about you. I did not do it, but can I recruit you? Made it out of there alive, so be it. Perhaps he will learn to keep his place in that village. Um, I doubt that, but he did want to thank you in the first place. There you go. It was luck that saved him, not any desire. The band, the hunt calls for blood, and by sure the debt will be repaid. You're boasting, or the halls, but enough of this. It is time oh. I moved on before all this talking brings the world leader upon us. Where are you headed next? Why is that any of your business, Lowlander? Join me, I could use another blade. Join you? My sword is the only companionship I need, and sure watches Jesus my Christ. back. You are not as useful as you think. The weapon doesn't make the warrior. You need me as much as I need you. That's no way to treat a friend. I'm quite good at judging, too. I know these lowlands much better than an outsider or wolf. Okay, fine. Blah, blah, blah. I do not even know who you are. And I, I have gold, if that's what you require. This blade. You, the strength okay. of the bear shows only one can lead. Okay, so you, gods, this person wants to fight me to become a companion, but perhaps speech is the way. Only strength okay, fine. Worth, not gold or talk. Prepare yourself, Lowlander. Okay. Show me what you are truly made of. Uh... It's big, bloody arrow. Jesus Christ. Have I just been hit by the stupid thing? I have. Quick, quick, quick. Heal potion, heal potion, heal potion. Heal potion, heal potion. potion. Alright, can we kill Klarna? Good job, Gladys. Okay, we did it. Speak with the warrior again. Oh, no, not Inigo. I... You hit... Such is the way, but it was. He'd keep the praise. Your victory was. I. I am okay, Khan, good. a warrior of the north. Should you. These lands are strange. Then may. Okay, right, so we pick up a new one. Sky, my blade clasp her hand and pull her back to her feet. She's already standing up, I'm just clasping her hands. Come here. Oh, and now she's. His name cool. is Mjord and we met a dog called Mjolnir. Watch where you leave food around. He's a scavenger at heart. Pat him. He will serve, but we have talked enough. Okay, right. So I think we picked up everyone. Um, the dog, the two corgis, uh, the cor Gladys is fighting Mjolnir dog. Um, <laughs> fine. <laughs> We've got our team. I won't lie. Um, Lucian is super dangerous with the staffs because he's dual wielding them, and I swear both Guys, of them are exceedingly please, dangerous. Can I see the Elder Scroll? You want to see the Elder Scroll? My life, and it's right. No, that's what? a terrible because idea. Risks, you mean? Uh, it's not but safe, Lucian. I, as a scientist, uh, no, I don't need to do something. Doing? Um, yeah. I need to trade Any something with you. Could really use you want a helmet? There's one in your inventory, you skull. idiot. Uh, right, I need to give you some soul gems, which actually have souls in them. Let's so take these lesser soul gems and, uh, I guess, of like half of these. Okay, that should be enough to actually keep your staffs filled up. Can the dog stop fighting, please? <sighs> Jeez. Right, um, Ori is northwest of the ruins. West of the ruins. I don't know if we need any more, right? Northwest. Say northwest of the ruins, so Ori is even further this way. Okay, right, so we'll go this way, and maybe we can also pick up Ori. Lucian is literally the embodiment of yes, so anyway, I started blasting. The guy just has like two Gatling guns strapped to either one of his arms, and is like, Yeah, I'm just gonna let rip, and uh, we'll see what happens. Okay, let me put my bow away, because I'm pretty sure. Okay, is this the thing? This kind of looks like a pod. Kind of thing. This looks like a. This looks like an oblivion shrine. That's a, it is a shrine. There's like a deer behind it. Is this a shrine of Akatosh? Glaive? Shrine of Magnus. You have a five percent spell absorption. Okay. Cool. Let's go even further northwest. 
This looks like enemies. There we go. Whoa, there's a wizard. There's a frost wizard. But I am resistant to frost. Lady, your frost means nothing to me. There's the Imperial, who I reckon we probably have to save. From the Necromancer Adept. Okay, no, the Imperial does seem pretty angry, actually. There we go, they're dead. We did it. We did it, guys. Oh, we are having to fight Bone Wolves. Watch out for the Bone Wolves. You know, I'm just going to leave them be. Uh, whatever you do, don't use the staffs, guys. That's going to be bad. Be careful when using the star. There we go. Don't fight each other. Good job, everyone. Everyone's on fire, so they're a bit upset. Um, all right, let me cast C. Is she up here? Um, oh, she's here. She's not doing too good. There's a Frostful book. That's Conjuration Insight. Uh, weak Disintegration. Poison. Use the altar. Oh, that looks fun, but also a bad idea. Uh, I mean, that seems like a pod, right? It's if you're northwest, not northeast. Yeah, but the donation said northwest. Of course that's where I'd go. There's a key needed for that. Um, northeast, west. Is that the orc stronghold? That looks like the orc stronghold. Could be wrong, though. Let's try going northeast then. Uh, northeast, not west. Okay, so this way. Um, oh dear. I'll drop down a save, just in case. Save those arrows. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ebony arrow is probably not the smartest ones to be using. Let's use elven arrows instead. We've got a fair few of them. What the hell is this? What is this? Ori's pod discovered. Right. Okay, well, here's Ori. Let's try. Hello. Hello. Can I help you? Oh, no. This is one of those weird... Oh, this is one of those weird sex ones, isn't it, guy? Oh, no. No, yes, it's not. But... I suppose it's not something we see very often in Skyrim, is it? Uh, yeah. Where I come from, they're very common. Oh, I see. Where are you from? Valenwood, all the way to Oh, the, the place where the cannibals Where's live. You? Are you from here? Is she going to offer to eat me or something? <laughs> um, I'm from elsewhere because I'm a cat, which is true. Elsewhere, huh? Yeah. Do you know Skyrim very well? Oh, uh, like the back of my hand. I don't suppose you're in need of a traveling companion. Oh, in need of traveling are companions, are you? I could use someone to show me around. Jesus, it's such. Me. This is literally. This there is. There's five ish days remaining day. until the end of the world, and this what guy's just say? busy raising his life up. And why not? I could use a traveling companion. Excellent. I'm looking forward to it. This weird lady. Is she going to get straight back into bed? Yep. Yeah, she is. <laughs> well, that was interesting. Seems you have competition, my friend. What is... What is wrong with her? What is wrong with her? <laughs> it's, oh, it's a jagger. What is this? Stamina increased by 25. Uh, it could be useful. Honey jar. So, you're a thane now, then. Does that mean I have to address you as my lord? What is you this? This is such a weird bed. fantasy mod. Sleep in bed. To be fair, we do actually need to sleep in bed. Uh, where's the bed sleep? Um, no, we don't need to, oh my god, we do kind of need to sleep in bed. We could really do a leveling up as well. Um, oh, it's, we need like an hour. Chat, don't judge! Don't judge, Mango, please don't judge! Please get out of the chat, don't judge! Please, don't judge! <laughs> please, my wife is watching! <laughs> please, fast, fast, there we go. Oh, I have a little I have a little dream. The first thing you notice is the heat. The strength of the inferno is hard to endure. Your eyes sting against the haze, the smoke filling your lungs. As you look around, you notice the entire forest is on fire. Ooh, wow, this is quite the nightmare indeed. Um Okay, I had a dream. Let's wake up. Um Mango, please don't judge. I need more companions. It just so happens that she's a weird elf lady. Chat told me to go get her. Oh my god. 
didn't take much convincing. Uh, people were paying me money. That's also not a good excuse. Um, do any of the... Jeez, look at all the butterflies here. Where are all of my companions? Are they all just hanging out inside the house? Um, do, 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 do. Everyone's still hanging out inside the house? Yeah, we are. Okay. All right, come on out, guys. Haven't even, haven't even been married a month and he's in bed with another woman. I've been married for over, like, four months now. I've been married for, like, five months. Oh, my goodness, Mango. We're nearing, like, half a year of being married. That's actually crazy. I don't There's just an orc over there. He must be part of the, um... Part of the big tribe, right? Yes, he is. Hello there, doggo. Alright. Let's go back to Falkreef and see if we can buy ourselves some uh, fast travel packs because we'll, we're going to need it to get around for the remainder of the game, I reckon. Did you level up? No, there was no... We hadn't got enough experience to level up, unfortunately. But yeah, we'll just go back into Falkreef and um, get some last-minute supplies before fast traveling up the mountain. Yeah, time sure goes by quick. It really does. It really, really does. Um, pimping Spiff. The <laughs> Pimping Spiff. Oh, yes. My lesser-known title of Pimping Brit. Um, <laughs> I can actually... I can move really fast. Jeez. Uh, here is the lovely Fall Creef. Also, I think if I fast travel on top of my horse, the horse should follow me on top of the mountain, which is kind of what I want. I think it's inside here is where we should be able to get ourselves uh, the fast travel pack. Um, oh, what would you like to do? Unlock... Knock. Knock. Is someone there? Hello. May I come in? Of course. He says, of course. There you go. That's very nice. Thank you. And nobody is following anymore. Yeah, I think they're going to... Um, They should teleport to me, I reckon, when I come in. Yeah, there we go. They all teleport in. Uh, Here's the man. Well met. Unlike my brother, I have no dislike of strangers. Oh, that's nice. While I was a storm cloak. Uh, Bolland seems upset. Do you mind if I just browse? Look around all you steal anything from my shop. I found out the store was broken into. The oh no! Oddly enough, that's interesting. I wonder what it means. Uh, do 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 do. do. Okay, no, I can't trade with you steal until. Anything from my shop. I'm guessing I can't trade with you for a couple hours, right? Um, that means I have to wait a couple of hours. Fine, we probably should anyway. Wait until nine, which is. Oh, 10, actually. There we go. Looking for something. Um, do you need any help in the shop? It would seem so. No, I don't want to work in the shop. What do you got for sale? Take a look. All right, here we go. Yeah, you've got the kind of stuff. You've got bone arrows as well. We'll take those. As many of those as you can offer, actually. Um, fire arrows are all useless. Uh, ice arrows. Oh, they're kind of fun. Uh, Necklace of Minor Gladiator. Ooh, look at all this cool stuff we could have had, like being able to block damage. Uh, fortunately, not for us anymore. Um, right. I'm hoping you have travel packs. You don't. Okay. Alright, back out into Skyrim we go. Oh, whoop. <laughs> Clip through the door. Um, Ori has maybe broken follower framework compatibility. Summon Ori. Is that like a skill I have? Here she is. How can I help? What is on your mind? I've noticed that many people react badly when I tell them about my dietary habits. Yep. And yet they have no. She's definitely a wood elf. <laughs> Bloody cannibals. What's the difference? I mean, to be honest, Chairman Meow has ate, has eaten several of his companions, so. I guess that's kind of fine. Right. We got the gang all together. We got Lucian. We got Kana. We got Inigo. Balrond will be somewhere. He's usually like leans up against a wall. Um, Lucian, you are looking knackered, but it's probably because you hit yourself with your magic. Um, Ori is literally just walking back to her house. Right. So, you're serious about becoming. Chat, I think this is where we do. This is where we give it a try. Let's drop down to save. Let's see if we can actually go defeat Alduin. Okay, everyone, I'm going to need as much of your assistance as we can muster. Uh, I want the bow on one. I want deadly poison on two. I want hagsbane on three. 
because that silences him. And then you can be four, actually. And stamina potions need to be, like, five. Oh, my God. Oh, and we need a version to poison as well. That's the first one we probably have to do. Tell her to follow you. Oh, she's not following me. Oh, all right. That would that would actually help. Hello. Yes. Follow me. I need your help. I'm right behind you. Thank you. All right, we've got the gang. The gang's all here, guys. Four. We've got a corgi. We've got a woman with a pet wolf. We've got a man who we've equipped with two staffs. We've got Balrond, who's just a wizard who friendly fires, and we've got Nigo, the classic. Oh my god, right. This is gonna be the hell of a fight. How do I change my vote? Actually, we can change the vote. We can do the poll right now. Connor, end the current poll and start a new one. Start the one of, um, do you think Spiff can defeat Aldwin? This try. Because we can do it on a try-by-try -try basis, right? This is where we're gonna put down the save. Um, and also, I can actually do something else. Um, let me quickly... Open up this my own stream. I can actually gift memberships. That's right. YouTube gives me 10 free memberships to give away each month. So, well, bam. Have 10 on me, chat. And then have... Uh, uh, sorry, I mean... Yes, there we go. There's all 10. Lovely. Just for you. For We're going to do great, guys. Trust me. Sources, trust me. <laughs> also, if you received a membership from me, you must legally like the stream. That's how it works. It helps. Um... Yankee2409 says, May the power of tea help you win. Thank you, Yankee. I'll do my best. And one caller guy says, Preemptive Fs in the chat, lads, or collect your best clown impressions. Those are your two options. You're either, you're either with me or you're against me. All right, Connor, have you started the poll? Um, Kevin says, Checked out the mod pack. There's a magical corgi named Merlin the Corgi. Yes, he exists in the College of Winterhold, which is a place you've never been to. But yeah, I'm pretty sure I've, uh, I've heard of that. Um, mm. If Aldrin kills you, does it still take a day off the counter? Yes, of course it does. Of course it does. Mod configuration, end times, 5.5 days. Let's go. Uh, he hasn't fired Connor. Okay, Mango, if you're watching, please fire Connor. Um, you have the rights, probably. Connor can't make the poll and neither can I. Okay, right, I'll make the poll then. Um, do 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 do. Uh, I can't believe seventy-four percent of people actually believed in me doing this as well. That's kind of incredible. Uh, do do do. Engage with audience. Start poll. Can Spiff defeat Aldwin? First try. Yes. No. Lol. There we go. Start the poll. Chat, I believe in me, and I hope that you believe in me too. Oh. Uh, yes, 62% of people have already said yes. That's a brilliant sign as we're about to cross the 6,000 like mark. This is the culmination of, generally, like what you're about to watch is the culmination of 42 hours of Skyrim gameplay. I have created, hopefully, the most powerful character I could possibly manage. Right. I want to, I want this, and I want, <coughs> we'll have this uh, hello done, I don't believe and we'll have properly this introduced. done. My name is Lucian Flavius. Lucian Flavius. I'm Ari. I suppose you and I will both be looking at Okay, they have follower interactions. I was wondering what on earth was going on. <laughs> you know, looking I should probably right. hand over yes. my magic potions, right? That's what I do. Belrand, do you want some? Good to see you. Oh, I can't even give you. I can't even force <laughs> Belrin to have it. Keep safe. Tidings. Right, you know, let me drop all of the magic potions on the ground. I kind of just don't want them in my inventory, so it feels like it makes hey sense. There. Okay, I can't even order you to pick them up. Do you do magic? No, you don't. You do. Do you do magic? Good morning. I need to do something. Certainly. What needs doing? Bye for now. Uh, I no. I need to do Certainly. something. What needs doing? Let me show you. I am at your service. Oh, I can just make him sing on command. Sure. Right, please pick up all of this. Sure. Consider it done. 
This is technically the second try already. You might want to point that out. No, this is about try number eight. Um, and no, I'm not going to point that out. Okay. 55% of people say yes. Um, which is honestly incredible. Let's hop on the horse. And let's go. Let's go, guys. To Alduin. He's on the throat of the world. Let's set our quest line to it, actually. Um, Alduin's Bane. Defeat Alduin. Drop down the save. <sighs> Chat, let's go. It's going to be one hell of a fight. Right up to the throat of the world we go. Do, do, do. <laughs> Come on. Incoming one hit kill, boys. We can hope. We can hope not. Right, out we hop. Here comes Alduin. Ah, uh, quick. Shout. Shout. Dragon Rend. Dragon Rend. Where's Alduin? There he is. Chat, come on up, everyone. My brave boys. There's Alduin. There we go. I think we hit him with Dragon Rend. We did. We really did. Oh my. Whoa! I was like, yes, the ice magic is doing nothing to us. <laughs> he shouts once. Shouts once. Once, I tell you. Oh, my God. Okay. Um, <laughs> for reference, by the way, I have, like, 350 health. Um... And I put all of my points into frost resistance because Alduin mostly does like frost stuff. But no, <laughs> the poll has now been resolved. <laughs> right, we will end that poll. Uh, luckily, we can start a second poll. Oh my goodness, start a poll. Uh, will we defeat Alduin take two? Yes. Nope. <laughs> These are the options. I wonder if the poll is going to be as, as what like as in my favour as it was last time. These are the questions I want to know. Yeah, I think next time we need to basically click this, chug the pill for rejuvenation, chug the draft of the shroud. Uh, maybe shroud is a good idea. That makes us become ethereal, which could actually help us. Um, the other is actually, do we have any potions of the marksman? This is just sneak attacks and spells, which is not the best. Fortify shouts, alteration. Here we go, Potion of the Marksman, 20% 20 20 extra damage with bows. Yeah, we can take that. That's easy. Um, don't forget the days, Spiff. Oh, you're right. How could I forget that I only have four days? <laughs> Thanks for reminding me, chat. That's super nice of you. So kind of you, chat. Uh, right, let's actually set the magic to Dragon Rend immediately. Because we're going to need it. Um, system save game. Oh, wow. 69% of people now say nope. Okay. Okay. Oh. There should be a mod that changes, Sky uh, that changes Skyrim um, after Elden wins. Well, there this mod exists and basically it just destroys Skyrim. Uh, like, I don't get to play after this. This is the end. So let's give it a go. One more time, one more time. So close. Yeah, it definitely felt close. Uh, it felt like I really had a chance there. Um, all right, let's get off. Um, all right. Pilfer of Rejuvenation. Chug that. Uh, Potion of the Marksman. Uh, Potion of the Assassin. The air is treacherously cold. Oh my god, I can't even see him anymore. I can't even see him. Where the hell is he? Do I get any hot food? Oh, there he is. Come on, did we get him? Yes, there we go. We did it. Uh, quick bone arrows. Right, we can get him. He's fighting my horse, I think. Oh, critical strike on him. Oh my god, Parthenax is coming down. Come on down, party snacks. There we go. An ego resisted dragon rend. Yeah, you'd hope so. Fight, my friends. Fight. Oh, we're doing great. Oh, the poison. The poison. 
quick, get him with the strong aversion to poison. We've got him. Someone is gravely injured. We're doing great. Deadly poison. His weapon is already poisoned. God damn it, right. I guess I have to hit him again, right? Oh my god, we're actually doing it though. This is actually going completely fine. Uh, deadly poison. Let's hit him with it. Bam. He did! Whoa! Yes! Oh. Yes. Oh my goodness. Yes, I have. Hello. I have. You are my little dragon. Bish. Little dragon bish. Little... Wait, is he just fully healed? Oh. Please tell me we don't have a second round. Oh, we do have a second round. Why does he get a second round? Oh, we did it. We completed it. St okay, we started the Fallen. Talk to Parthenax. Or Esburn. Or Argon... Has he gone now? Has he just downright cleared off? Where's Party Snacks? Come back, Party Snacks. We need to discuss what the hell just happened. Whoa! We did it! Where the hell is he? Can we now look at the, uh, the Fallen quest line? Party Snacks, we need a chat. We did good, though. We did really good. I've dropped down the save. Literally never doubted you. Chat. We did it. This is for everyone who donated. Everyone who said we could do it. Everyone who believed in Chairman Meow. Yes, we did it. Uh, it. I need to... It wasn't really a victory since Alduin escaped. True, this is not the final battle. not the final Victory. Alduin always was Pachlok. Arrogant, in yes. Power. This should shake the loyalty of the door. Oh, yes, it shakes him. the loyalty, yes. I need to find out where he went. Yes, one of his allies could tell us. Mat Mahus. But it will not be so easy to convince one of the... Yes. Okay, so now we need to do the whole Dragon's Reach. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Dragon's Reach was built to hold a dragon, yes. Fantastic. Okay, so now our quest is very simple. We have to talk to the Yarl of Whiterun and... Um, Ask if we can trap a dragon in his uh, house. Uh, <laughs> Smith has three days to do like four more quests. It's honestly not too bad. The next few quests aren't too bad. Um, I can't remember which direction White Run is. Uh, let me quickly get my ethereal shot. Become ethereal. Um, how long does this last again? Uh, this one doesn't last very long at all. Um, have I got another become ethereal potion? Uh, do, 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 do. Where's my draft of the shroud? There we go. Bam. Chug this. All right. Now we are fine to just run off the mountain. This is how we have to fast travel, okay, guys? Because we don't have. You have to do the true stuff. That doesn't. That doesn't take too long. That doesn't take too long. You can speech check it. You don't have to. Um, you don't have to do the whole civil war. We can just try and speech check our way through it. Um, please tell me I'm falling down the right way. I think so. I think this is towards White Run. It's kind of a guess, but I think I'm right. Uh, this bit doesn't feel too right. Oh, this is some steps. Um, White Run? Are you down, out, out this way? Maybe? Maybe like this way a bit more? Oh, we're really falling here. Um, well, let's try and get to the ground because I don't want to try and use another potion. There we go, come on, down, 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 we go. Get to the bottom, get to the bottom, get to the bottom, race to the bottom. Oh, we might have to use another potion. Okay, that's fine, we can. Right. Do the shout, jump. 
tip the final fight in, uh, in Sovereign Guard. In, uh, Inigo can follow you if you can do his quest. Then you get, you'll get a teleport spell for him, and he can help you. I honestly don't know if I want Inigo there. He's a, he's, he's a cat. I'm a cat. There are two fights in Sovereign Guard that are pretty brutal. No, the first one's actually not that bad um, against the Door Guard. We, we, can, we should be able to actually defeat him pretty easily. Um, just the one against Alduin that I'm kind of worried about. Um, I think we're somewhere around Riverwood. I think Riverwood's there. White Run's about there. Please add 10 more days, Spiff. I'll leave that up to the chat to decide if I get an overtime, but um, I, I, it would need an overwhelming consensus because I'm of the opinion that, especially when you've been in a challenge for as long as me, you shouldn't give yourself a way out. This is this is the future I, I was stuck with. Maybe, like, if I don't it succeed we can do a members overtime from like a save file from here but i don't think that we should but actually i'm certain we shouldn't we've we've lived with this character we should die with this character that's how it should be okay where on earth have i ended up please tell me i did not go out the riften side because if i did we're kind of screwed um no this looks like the right yeah this is the correct place lovely we're good we're all good Oh, let's go. <sighs> right, let's do this. Half a day? I can't add half a day. I can only add a full day. Nothing extra, no freebies. It's either a challenge or it's just content. Exactly. I agree. I set the rules of my challenge. I should be sticking Where to them. You? Hello. It does not matter to Maik how strong or smart one is. Okay, Maik. Thank you, Maik. That's very nice of you, Maik. The liar. He is retiring? Yes, exactly. No, I'm not retiring. Uh, but that was a hell of a fight, guys. <sighs> Close the poll, you sausage. Yeah, we need to... I also like the fact that some people after the fact voted yes, because, you know, I actually did manage to defeat Aldrin. So, like, yeah, you know, I voted yes the whole time. I definitely knew. No, that that was like 70% of people said I could not defeat Aldrin. And then I did. Then I did. I smashed it. Oh, right. Did you have left the chat in disgust, Log? Did he really? That's pretty funny. I'm glad he's having fun. Um, right, let's have a chat with the Yarl. Oh. Um. Uh. Hello. Saw some made sure off a magic trinket you bought a couple days ago. Word is you were the one that enchanted it. Oh. What happened? Where are you? <laughs> I need to ask you to stop. You're what? Not fooling anyone. This is your last warning. Okay. Good. Glad we straightened that out. What? <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> what the hell is going on there? <laughs> I don't even allow that. You defeated the world nibbler. Mm, temporarily. The thing is, I'm not too sure if me defeating Alduin then defeats, stops the, um, stops the end of the world from happening. Because, I mean, he can come back. Spiff, good luck with the negotiation quest. It's not too bad. You can do it. Because you can just dialogue, speech check it. You don't have to actually go about the whole complicated quest line. Like, we can just bypass it. Uh, Spiff, I assume there's no go back in time spell. I mean, technically the Elder Scroll kind of lets you do that. But, um, yeah, unfortunately we have not learned that ability at all. Right, let's go up and have a chat with the Yarl. The world will end in four days. Ooh. Let's go. Let's go. Everyone is running around like lunatics. Evidently, they know the world's ending. They're all having a grand old time. You have to go to Sovereign Guard? I know. Can't wait. It's going to be great fun. I just got here. Did Spiff beat Alduin? Uh, we beat him the first time. We now have to go to Sovereign Guard to defeat him a second time. Um, surely he can't end the world if he isn't in the world. Well, he's kind of... That's the thing that I don't know. There's a chance the mod pack won't let him defeat the world because, you know, we've killed him. But I'm not willing to place enough bets on that being the case. Anyway, hey, y'all. Well, hey Hello. Hey there. I need your help. I need to trap a dragon uh, in your palace. I must have misheard you. I thought you asked me to help you trap a dragon in my palace. Yes, that's exactly. Uh, you know I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important. I'm sorry, but I can't do it. We'll just have to keep fighting the dragons as best we can. 
Wait, is there a possibility to... I need your help. I need to trap a you dragon in your palace. You want me to let a dragon into the heart of my city with the threat of war oh, on my is there a way to Is there a way to speed past this with Persuade? Keep safe. Because if there is, we could maybe speech check this. Okay, let's try and boost up my speech. Um, wash and rinse. Let's give this wash and rinse a go. Bow, 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 bow. Gotta wash, gotta wash. There we go. Feel nice and warm. There we go. Looking good, looking good. Absolutely Hello. splendid. I'm on. I am pleased to meet you. My name is Inigo. Um, he gave himself another day when he was supposed to remove one. He just didn't notice. Did I seriously? I suppose there's a way we can check this because I we can look at the amount of deaths I have. Um, right there we go. Putting everything back on. I think that is us now done. We are back to normal. Um, yeah, we can check this. If we go J general stats and combat, was it general just deaths? Uh, diseases contracted only one. Not bad. Combat? Uh, I guess it doesn't tell you how many deaths you have, right? We've just been keeping track. I've just been keeping track of that myself, so. Yeah, I guess I don't actually know. I really don't know. Wow, I'm surprised. Unless it says so in here and I'm just completely blind. Um, went from 45 to 44. Yeah, that's correct. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Um, yeah, I gave the Yarl a nice view whilst I was doing that, so surely he likes me now. Um, let's see if we have a potion of speech. Potion of the merchant. That's better prices. I don't know if that's the same. Um, let me give it a try. It might still just fortify it. Potion of the cut purse. Potion of alteration. Fortify shouts. Uh We can give it a try. We'll give it a try. Potion of the Merchant. Let's give it a try. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. And then, actually, we can also put on our Victory Crown, because I think that might also help us. The lovely Victory Reef gives us better prices, so surely it would remind the Yarl of how Where great are we are. You? Where am I? I'm here. What you're asking. You want me to let the dragon... Persuade. I'm sorry. Damn it. Do it. We'll just Dragon's Reach was built to hold a left. dragon. Yarl, they... Numenex was the dragon's yes. name. That's his skull. Why well, can I say nothing? What? Hmm. Where are you? What is it that you need? <laughs> um. Uh. I need your help what to trap a dragon. You want me to let a dragon into the heart of my city, with the threat of war on my doorstep. Oh God, maybe I should. Is it possible to persuade him? It might be. All right then. Because let me check my skills. My speech is 49. Deep breath, your shouts are stronger. You're more likely to succeed at persuasion and intimidation. That's literally just from this. Let me have a chat with... Let me have a chat. Oh, nope, unless m mod. Okay, fine. Someone says, yes, I did. Go give the beggar some coin. That's a good idea. Yeah, I think uh, NPCs actually can't detect me at the moment. Yes. Because I'm kind of very, very, very good at uh, natural resting sneak, I guess, is my benefit. Are you the child who I can buy a flower from? Have some gold. Oh, thank you. Divines, there you go. Gift of charity. Way. I'm such a great person, I know. Uh, you need really high speech. You should try, try stripping again. Second time's a charm. Oh, dear. In vanilla, you need 50 speech. Okay, well, we've gone up above that. Welcome. What can I do for you? What do you got for so sale? You're interested in my potions and Have you got fortify voice? That's not quite the same. Um, cure disease, extreme healing, muffling, solution of strength. Nope. Is there ingredients that fortify speech? Hey, if you distract the clerk, I'll be 
have some goods. Okay. Um, I don't think there is any of this. Is not good. Not good at all. Nope. As you wish, my friend. Damn it! You need to reload the save spiff. Oh, okay. You have to reload before you try to persuade. You can't try twice. Okay, that's what we'll do. We arrived in Dragon's Reach. Let's go. We can do this again. Spiff, where the sex mods? Unfortunately, we didn't install any of the sex mods. Um, <laughs> I'm afraid. Amulet of Debella is... We could do. I don't have one in my inventory, though, and I can't really be bothered to go pick one up. Uh, can't persuade twice? Well, we'll give it a go. Um... All the gifters today, thank you. Yeah, I know, they've been really nice, haven't they, Luna? My little clips, thank you very much, as always. You're, like, here for every single one, which is kind of crazy. Um, yeah, Present99, thank you, of course, all the, also for your final tip. That was really useful. Fred Jones, as well, thank you so much. I do love a bit of rain. You're right, actually, that is a nice thing. Right, this way. Do, 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 do. Fortify banter is butterfly wing plus tundra cotton. That's only in the base game. This in modded version like this, that's not the case. Right, where's the child? Here you are. You're the best. Have some money. Bless your kind heart. I know. Bless my heart indeed. Blah 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 blah. Right, back up we go. Let's wash ourselves and then have a chat with the yard. Oh, Spiff, what are your stats at? Some of them are really good. Like, my Resist Frost is really, really, really good. But that's, uh, I'd say that's the best. Why is this the last Skyrim stream? Because it's the end of the 100 days challenge we've been doing. Like, we only have four days left. So, yeah, this is one hell of a fight. But we should hopefully be able to... Actually, do we need to eat some meat? There we go. We were stressed, but not anymore. Um, let's quickly have a wash and a rinse. Hey, I'll be. Take a look at me. You have an amulet of articulation? No, we definitely don't. Definitely don't. Um, yeah, why not make a potion of fortified speech? Because uh, I don't think in the mod pack that speech potion exists. Um, at all. I do, by the way, chat, I really appreciate all the people who are very good at, um, <laughs> at reminding people that they are meant to read the description of the live stream. It's very nice of you to remind them. <laughs> Thank you. You didn't have to, but you're very kind. All right. Uh, let me try put on the hat as well for the maybe, maybe it gives us an edge. I don't know. That's what we have to find out. Right, save, new save. Um, what is our speech, Gilat? 59. That's the best we can hope for. Do you have the speech mask from Dragon Priest? No, uh, they're all different. They're all uh, different mods. Well, all of the Dragon Priest masks are different, if that's what you mean. Um, let me actually check. Gladys, have you got anything? No, that just muffles an ego's idle chatter. Uh, you have the Wabberjack. Yeah, I forgot we gave you the Wabberjack. Um, <laughs> ooh. Absorb 80 health. I mean, I can't really give that to... Um, I can't give that to my staff boy, because he's definitely going to murder everyone. Um, all right, let's go. Where are you? Where am I? I'm right here, yo, Belgriff. I need your palace to trap a dragon. Persuade. Sorry, but I can't do it. Damn it, we failed. Just have to keep fighting the Can I give it another try? Let's give it another try. Well, oh, viewer count is greater than nine thousand. Yeah, no, it's actually crazy. It's actually crazy. I don't know if um, this is actually possible. Ray B says you probably won't see this, Biff, but you're the best channel on YouTube, hands down. I see everything, Ray B. Every single comment, I absorb it. Thank you very much. I am up. I'm sorry, but I can't do it. Oh. We just have to keep fighting the dragons as best we can. Speech checks are supposed to be set, not random. Yeah. I mean, there is the silver tongue, which is you're more likely to persuade a persuasion. But we don't have a perk point for it, so... 
I think this is us buggered. Yeah. Even though uh, I lovely tried to um, save scum that, uh, I don't think we can do it. Uh, you could sell a bunch of uh, crap to level it. Yeah, maybe. But I think we. Um, I need the silver tongue pug. Oh, the thing is, it's the only way we're going to be able to actually. Um, it's the only way we'll be able to win. So we kind of have to. We have to give this a try. Right. Gladys, I need you to carry something. Have you got enchanted stuff in your inventory that I can disenchant? Um, maybe the stuff for the lightning bolts? Uh, we can maybe disenchant that. Okay, let's go give this a try. Basically, I need to try and cross over the leveling threshold. Um, do, 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 do. No, I can't. Okay, well, I can try and make enchant stuff. Let, uh, let's make a fortified block with a soul gem. That gave a little bit. Let's get a sapphire ring with fortify uh, light armor. Or conjuration, yeah, conjuration seems good. Two-handed, uh, resist frost. Let's go conjuration, uh, petty soul gem. Craft it, good. Let's try and just make a bunch of those. Wedding ring, fortify conjuration, petty soul gem, craft. Um, silver garnet ring, fortify conjuration, petty soul gem, craft. Uh, it's all basically about value, if I remember correctly, when it comes to these. So we go, we're up to 59. Uh, I don't think I have enough to get over the threshold without using the greater soul gems on effectively useless enchantments. I could make a better frost resistance ring, maybe. Actually, no, that isn't even better. Um, make myself harder to detect when sneaking. I mean, I could become completely undetectable. We could go full full chameleon, uh, which is a bit cheesy. Now ah, let's give it a try. Actually, it's not. It doesn't. It, yeah, it's not valued at the highest amount, which is what we need. Let's make this ebony ring. There we go. And craft. Good stuff. Silver necklace. Articulation. We can make an articulation. Speech is increased by eight points. Okay. Okay. That's better. That's better. Now we just alchemy. We need to get over the threshold of leveling up. Um, fortify block. Sure, let's go. Um, fortify conjuration. Amazing. Fortify health. Bam. Bam, make a bunch of those, whatever they are. Whatever this is. This and this. Awesome, make that. Fortify power attacks. Brilliant. Whatever this is, amazing. Um, pickpocket. Okay, Personally, Alchemy's leveled I up like again. To wash anything I taste before I let it abuse my insides. Let's go for this. Potion of Mending. Fortify sneak attack. Tax for fire and arms. Great ideas for potions you could make. Want to hear it? Oh, of course you do. I, do I don't want to hear about your potions dodges potions, Lucian. Extra arm. The Handy, muffle. Right? That's a terrible joke. Uh, make a bunch of those. We don't have enough empty potion bottles. Okay, we've run out of empty. Oh shit, is the game crashed? No, the game might have crashed. I think the game's crashed. Oh, the game has crashed. It's definitely crashed. No, it hasn't. I just need to press escape a second time. Whoa, my heart. Oh, my kidneys. Whoa. We are on save 90. Jeez. Okay. Um, we are literally cooking at an insane degree. Uh, let us drink as many of these potions as we can. Uh, draft of the Assassin. Chug that. Um, basically, because every time we drink one of these, we get another, another potion bottle back. So let's grab this and this and... Um, draft of Conjuration. Yeah, we can drink all of those. Uh, draft of Conjuration. Let's go. Let's give you a key. We'll bound you to the two key. Whew. 
Oh, it's all good. That counts as a death. It doesn't count as a death. We're doing amazing. Don't forget to equip that speech amulet you just made. Yep, we won't. We're doing amazing. Sell the potions. Potions, yeah, might level up speech a little bit, but our merchants are low on gold, and really we just need to push the level up. Alright, alchemy lab. Let's go. And there we go, level up. Is that enough to cross over the threshold? Yes, it is. Level 34! <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Uh, we need to sleep anyway. Um, it is 7pm, so there's no merchants we're going to be able to sell to outside of, like, um, maybe you? Can we sell to you? Hello, I'm here. What do you got for sale? And for those um, I might have some stuff for you in terms of gems. Um, I've got some notes as well. Annals... Anim Annals of the Dragon Guard. You can have that. Enigo's Journal. You can have that. That's a bit of s nonsense. Conjure Familiar. Don't need that. You can have that. Um, scrolls. You can definitely have all of these. We're definitely not using any of them. Uh, the Bound... Actually, the Bound Bow was good. If you ever summon Scroll of Bound Bow, that would not be bad. Uh, scroll of Bound Battle Axe Dagger. Yeah. Okay, they don't have it, unfortunately, but that's okay. Um, what else can I sell you? These ebony rings? You can have them. Bam. Okay, that's a little bit of selling. Remember, your mind is the best weapon you have. A little bit of selling. Um, you look fun. Hello, Mr. Adventurer. Yes. What on earth? How did you do that? Yeah, I'm definitely too invisible Need something? for some people. Which is a good problem to have. Oh, what do I mean the end of Skyrim? Read the description. Spiff, $500 donation. Yes, I noticed the $500 Australian dollar donation from White Run Guard 173. He's a big fan of our works, guys. And we're a big fan of White Run Guard. Right, down we go. Our level still isn't the best. Well, it's okay. Um, we can go outside and speak to the Khajiits and try and sell... Uh, get us over the little speech ledge, I think is probably our next best bet. But yeah, I think we should be able to speech check this. Yeah, because there's so many mods that patch the exploits I'm doing, I'm kind of okay with doing this uh, this cheesing. And bro, stop wasting time. This is the only way. If we have to convince all of the guards of the land to go and... Well, all of the, you know, factions of the Civil War to come to do a council, that's going to take forever. The best way for us to do it is to spend, like, half a day, or in this case, probably one day, getting ourselves set up so that we're able to, um... So that we're able to hopefully, yeah, survive the dragon apocalypse. Um, hello, Rissard. Take a look. What have you got for sale? You got, you've only got 165 gold. That's not the best. Um, you can have this staff of bolts. I think I get speech XP when I sell you stuff, even though I, you don't have gold, right? Pretty sure that still gives me experience. Uh, I'm not certain. I mean, I just gave them a free bow, basically, but that's okay. Um, go and level up. Yep, that's what I'm going to go do. Greetings from Birmingham, Spiff. Thank you, John Perks. Uh, Clayton Heffley donates five dollars. Say the British Museum doesn't celebrate April Fools because they prank every country's uh, because they prank other countries every other day, which is true. Very true. We do. Yeah, the guards actually can't spot me, which is pretty funny. All right, let's sit down. Um, do 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 do. All right, let us sleep for one hour tactically. Oh, I had a dream about Alduin. Uh, let's level up health, I guess. Yeah, I mean it might help us. You never know. Perk, let's go silver tongue. Let's go. Oh, okay, let's go. Hello, channel dot the dot. Nice to have you in chat. Where's the submissive elf girl? <laughs> so we don't. I don't want to even acknowledge Ori's existence. 
the fact that these mod packs have pushed me to hiring the, the smutty companions because we like I, we've lost so many companions by the way in this fight if, if you haven't seen the previous live streams like the amount of companions that have died and we've had to eat their corpses as well because chat told me to yeah it's um it's quite a lot uh okay Catter in chat says, Spiff, would you consider doing the Dungeon Crawler Endless Dungeons Challenge? Yes, uh, Juve has been working on it, and I don't really want to cover it until after he's happy with it, because, you know, it's his project, and it's kind of, it'd be rough if I ran along and I was like, ah, oh, yes, I'm going to make a viral video on your glorious video idea before he has the opportunity to. But yeah, uh, it's a really, really cool mod pack that he's building, and really, really fun. Okay, so we've slept. Did you equip the amulet? I haven't yet. I'm about to. Don't worry. I'm about to. Um, right. So we can pop on the amulet. Here we go. Speech is increased by 8 points. Our speech is up to 67. We're doing pretty good. Where is the Yarl? Is he in bed? Where are you? I'm in front of you. Safe, I hope. Oh, he's up here. He's up here. He's up here. Oh, Me yeah, he is in bed. It's like the Limmy meme of the of him being woken up from his, from sleep. Um, it's like me finding the owl and just shouting at him whilst he's asleep. Hey, I need to trap a dragon um, in your palace. Right, let's drop down the save. Right, cross your fingers, guys. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Um, I need to trap a dragon in your palace. Uh, I must have misheard. You. Come on, you know I wouldn't ask, ask if it wasn't important. Let's go. Fingers crossed. Of course. Yes! Yes! I owe you a great deal. Why let a dragon into the heart? The threat is worse than you know. Alduin has returned. The world eater himself. But how can we fight him? I'm. Doesn't his return mean it's the end times? Maybe so, but I plan to go down fighting. What about you? You know what? That is kind of my vibe, but I'm the Dragonborn. It's my destiny to stop him. I don't him. know about such things. Now, what's this nonsense about It's the only way to find out to help you Alden before it's too late. And I Ulfric and General Tullius are both just wait. Oh, you no. No. I can't risk weakening the city while... Then... The getting no, god damn, I still have to do weak. this? Maybe. If the Greybeard oh, were willing god. to host the Peace Council... I, Dragonborn, maybe you can stop the dragons and this... My men will be ready when you are, Dragonborn. You have a truce to arrange first, eh? Damn it. I still have to do this. I did all of that leveling for nothing. <sighs> Thanks. Thanks, game. Thank you, game. Thank you. Scott Wiggum, thank you for gifting 50 memberships in the chat. Oh my god, let's go. Just for you. We're gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going. I believe we can do this. Just make a team score with them all. Yeah, if only we could just Zoom chat. Imagine the most... Oh, that would be the most awkward Zoom call in the world. You've got like... Yarl Balgriff, the Greybeards, a bunch of the, uh, the the Yarls all on a little call together. We need 10 days. You're not getting 10 days. How many days have we got left? How many days? Four. Four days. Four days. Also, Scott, thank you so much for gifting memberships again. Like, it's you're insanely generous. Um, if you received a gifted membership from Scott in the chat, please say thank you to him. Um, he's far too kind. Right. Talk to Arn Gear. Ah, my God. I've got to go all the way back up to High Rothgar, which means I need another fast travel thing. Else we're going to be potentially a little bit screwed. Better feed him poison for baiting you like that? I mean, maybe. So if you can fast travel, I can only fast travel if I have a travel pack and they get consumed each time I fast travel. So, yeah. 
Not much. Not much at all. There's a chance the cats have restocked a fast travel pack, but it's a slim chance. Um, let's have a chat. What do you got for sale? Uh, do, 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 be over in here. No, they got soap, but that's about it. Soap and a shovel. Still has not restocked. But yeah, I can't... Um, <laughs> Y'all, we can't hear you. Your mic is muted. <laughs> yeah, I can't fast travel, unfortunately. Um, if you notice when I click on it, it just places a custom destination. Uh, inns always have travel bags, Spiff. Seriously? Hmm. I didn't know that they did, but I'll give it a try. Remember when you walked everywhere and ignored travel packs early in the challenge, lol? I remember! I don't want to be reminded of that, but I remember. Spiff inns always have travel bags. We're going. We're going. I can't believe I just knocked into that elf. Uh, <laughs> thank you, chat, for the idea. You can craft them at a forge fairly easily. Oh, I mean, we might be able to craft them. I'll take a look. Um, do, 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 do. Uh, that's animal pack. Do, 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 do. I guess it would be an other, right? Uh, no. Supplies? Here we go. Travel pack. Firewood, leather strips, and torch. Eh. I'll check the inn first before I bother going into inventories. you have to do the meeting if you complete the Civil War questline? No, you don't, but I don't think I have time to complete, you know, the Siege of Whiterun in four days. Um, how much time does fast travel actually save, chat? Quite a bit. It takes 20 minutes. Uh, four days, eyes. 20 minutes. Let's save that appetite, hmm? And I'm probably going to have to do... There we go, you sell them. Amazing. Thank you very much. Welcome. Good read, work. chat. Good read. And also, because it's midnight anyway, I don't really want to travel. Because uh, it's a bit dangerous. Okay, system. Save. Quick save. Okay, um, let's go meet the uh, the Greybeards. How many hours are you wasting in game when you use a travel pack? Not as much, because it's like... Because the distance to High Rothgar is... Yeah, we lost maybe three hours in game, which is like seven minutes IRL time. Because you have to realize I have to travel all the way around here to try and climb up High Hrothgar, which is an insane amount of time. It would have taken us probably about 10 in-game hours to actually travel without the travel pack, which is why we have to have it. It just makes it so much easier. We won't use it to get back off, because of course we can use our, um, our what is it, the fall off the mountain uh, ethereal shout, which should help us. Where is the old boy? Where's the old boy? Old man, old man, where are you? Over here. Oh, he's the other side. Uh, do 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 do. Oh, don't block me in the corner. Jump. I, Jump. I am here, but heroes of old once walked. Only Sovngarde itself could exceed. Hello. We heard the dragon wren shout from here. You, you defeated him. Yes, we did, but he escaped. I need to find his portal to Sovngarde. I, much. I thought it was him we saw flying east after. I need your help. I need to capture a dragon. Warriors, what is overlooked in the Dragonborn, is not permitted to any other followers. Uh, I'll worry about capturing a dragon. I need your help to stop the you war. Understand our authority. Yes, the here we go. Have never involved themselves in political affairs. Uh, Yell Belgraf won't help me while the war rages. The dragon will lead you to Aldwin, but without the Jarl's help. Both sides respect the Greybeards, they will listen. Artanax has made the decision to even the Greybeards. So be it. Tell Ulfric and General Tullius that the Greybeards wish to speak to him. We'll see if they still remember us. Oh my goodness. Are you ready to host the Peace Council? Deliver message to the warring parties. If they will listen, I will do what I can okay. to bring them to terms. Right. I above. Okay, we can. Um, the best way for us to travel now would probably be throw ourselves off the mountain using Ethereal and take a cart to each of them. Ah, oh, 
god. Um, right, what do we got? Uh, White Run is. Where's White Run again? There's White Run. So we can throw ourselves off here. Um, I haven't got any more ethereal potions, unfortunately, but that's fine. Do 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 do. Okay. Uh, so yeah, our mission is speak to Ulfric Stormcloak, speak to General Tullius. So yeah, let's go to the White Run stables. Magic. Let's go shout. Uh, become ethereal. There we go. Right. Drop down a quick save. Let's go. Throw myself off the mountain really quick. Really quick. There we go. We hit the ground. Lovely. We're fine. Oh! 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 Balls! No! 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 I know I have a second travel pack. I'm saving it to get back up here. Oh my god. <sighs> right, we give this another go. We just do this even safer than before. Even safer than before. We're not even nice and safe. Okay, wait until it's until it's ready to go again. Oh my god. Just buy another, you fool. Yeah, screw it, you're right. You're right, we're, we're fast traveling to Windhelm. Palace of Kings. <laughs> this is too... Uh, we lost 24 hours over that. Oh my god. Yeah, I know we can buy another one. I just didn't want to because I thought it would be um, it would take too long. World will end in three days. Oh my god, let's bring in all of our people. Into the Palace of Kings we go. Let's have a chat with the Jarl. Hello, who are you? You look funky. Why are you defiling the Palace of the Kings with your presence, rug? Oh, they're races towards cats again. Hello. Do I know you? Uh, I was at Helgen. Ah, yeah. Not everyone can say they made it out of Helgen. I could have gone anywhere. I came here to fight the Empire. Uh, no, I didn't. I, re I didn't. I don't want to fight the Empire. Um, I have a message from the Greybeards. I have the greatest respect for the Greybeards, of course. But the political... I can't afford to appear weak. I can't agree to this unless Tully... All do it. There we go. Even Tullius may be forced to talk. Yes, I'll give Tullius. There we go. We did it. All right, fantastic. We we convinced the Yarl. Now we go speak to the other one. But yeah, she generally just called me a rogue. Um, Spiff, don't waste time. I'm really trying not to waste time. It costs more dying and getting it. I know. I, it's a mistake. These mistakes happen. It's really rough as well because of how close we are. Like we're so close, and then I accidentally just walk off a ledge. Like. Yeah, what more can you do? That's just... Sometimes that is Skyrim. Come on in. Just uh, fire. That, screw, that speech grind going. really did pay off, I though. Told you, my friend. I'm not going on like, that was huge thanks to them. Be out there fighting the Hello. Hello. What do you got for sale? Show me your travel packs. There we go. Free travel packs. Thank you. Okay, we did it. Um, let's use the cart, because I guess is the cart faster than maybe my le my travel pack? I guess, in my opinion, that's probably true, right? Losing a day greater than, like, 50 gold. I know! I'm sorry, it's genuinely just smooth brain. It's, when you've been playing Skyrim for, like, three hours straight, you're gonna make a mistake. And it sucks that I made, if I made that mistake, like, you know, several streams ago, it doesn't feel anywhere near as bad. But making that mistake right now on the final stream oof that's rough we're pulling close though I, I genuinely do believe in us like we've got a really kind of good thing going right drop down a quick save 
can take you to any of the I'd like to hide the carriage. Go. Solitude, please. Climb and back and we'll be off. Solitude's a big poor town, you know. Spiff regretting continuing the glitched falling death away, in Solitude now, her? Yeah. Most of them's foreigners yeah, yeah. Buyers, of course. I remember that. There was so if you don't remember a couple of streams ago, um I we had like a perma glitch where we walked out of a shop and I died by repeatedly falling because of a glitch in the mod pack and I decided to count the deaths and then take an extra one to reset and uh, yeah if we had an extra two days right now that would be great we don't unfortunately we don't just don't die it's simple we can believe I also like that YouTube's telling me that now would be a good time to insert ads. If you don't know on the back end, have like a big button and I can push it and it just summons ads. The problem is, it's a terrible idea. Like, there's <laughs> like 9,000 people watching. I push the button and what, I make like £5.50, maybe like £10. Uh, and in return, a bunch of people have to watch ads. Yeah, not not needed. We're here for the live experience, damn it. Jeez, look at all these people covered in blood. There's a dragon, guys. Whoa! Inside, 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 inside. Um, the peril is content. Agreed. Agreed. It's the peril that makes it more fun. Hello, General Tullius. You? you were at Helgen. Speak to Legged Ricca. I suspect we could use someone like you. That's not why I'm See, here. Then there's nothing further to discuss. If you change your mind, speak with the Legged. I have a message from the Greybeards. What do those uh, they're com convening a peace council at High Rothgar. Well, there's nothing to discuss. We need a truce. getting to be a problem, but I wasn't. My job is to quell this rebellion, and I intend to do just that. Uh, the, dragons the dragons are a bigger problem than the Stormcloaks right now. They have a point. It's getting difficult to even move troops around. By all accounts, the Stormcloaks are suffering just as badly. Yes, yes, fine. There we go. Come to this Greybeard council. For all the good it will do. There we go. So he's up for it. Now we just have to go back. Um, can we fast travel whilst there's a dragon attacking the city? And also, how badly is the world on fire? You will not get me oh my god, this is bad. This is actually really bad. Uh, where's Dragon Red? There's Dragon Red. Who caused that stupid spell? Why does this dragon have... So much health! I need to pick a different... Different one. Oh my god. Lingering poison. My weapon is already poisoned. Different boat. Different arrows. Different arrows. Oh, he's get, pulling low on health. Oh! I hit him with the other poison. Karna is dead! God damn it, is Karna dead? Oh no, did I accidentally kill Karna with one of my own arrows? Ball, oh, she's dead! Oh my god. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You're going down, friend. You are going to die whether we like it or not. Oh my god. Hey, you can't fit through the door. Oh, you can do that! Drink, 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 drink. Uh, Jesus Christ. Come on, he's almost dead, he's almost dead, he's almost dead. We did it. Okay, we lost a companion, but we're out of here. Gladys, you're okay. This is a legendary dragon. Oh my god, it had so... It's killed so much! General Tullius, you've lost most of a garrison. Khan is dead. There's an ash pile here. I have no idea whose this was. Or he's still alive. Inigo, are you still alive? Inigo? There's a bunch of dead Imperial soldiers. Yeah, Inigo's still alive. I think Belrin's still alive because I haven't found him. Yeah, he is. There's Lucian. Oh, there's three of them in Skaldafan? Oh, that'll be easy then. We've got it. No problem. Four. You're boned, my guy. <laughs> it's okay. We're doing great. We're doing great. Oh. 
we're doing great. We're gonna do amazing. Oh, why does he have a corgi? Mods, my friend, mods. Um, right, let's eat some food. Salmon steaks. And let's Not enjoying yourself. fast travel to the Greybeards. Okay, chat, I'm gonna need people to remind me what the correct negotiation is. Because I can't remember. You need a pact and where I picked up a bunch. Right. I've got like four. Peace treaty. I feel it's worth mentioning we could Two days left. We have two days to go. Oh my god. Okay, let's have a chat with him. Hello, Angie. Oh, you've done it. I should not have agreed uh. to host this council. The Greybeards have no business. Peace? They are not yet tired of war. Far from it. Do you but regrets? Take your seat at the council table. And let us see what wisdom... Oh my goodness. Let's go. Let's try our best. A consume friend? We don't have time. Because the problem is, if we consume friend, we get a speech debuff. And we genuinely don't have time to get a speech debuff. Take your seat and we can begin. Where's the seat? You know why we're here. Are you going to let us in or not? How's the blades? You're not welcome here. We have as much right to be at this council as all of you. More actually. Thank you, Delphine. We were the hey, Esburn. The dragonborn on this path. Were you? Hubris of the blades truly knows no bounds. If it were up to you, the dragonborn would take three minutes uh. to mount and doing nothing. We can do this. We're not here to rehearse or graduate. The matter at hand is urgent. Eat your companion in front of them so you, they know you mean business. We can't do that. That's way too much. Like, come on. I would normally go for the meme, but we have been so... this. We are so close to potentially actually doing it that I can't. This is too important. All right. Very well. Guys, if you could speed up your conversation, that would make my life easier. Here we go, right in the main hall. It's like over along here somewhere. I think. If I remember correctly. Where else is it? Oh, here it is. Found it. Look at everyone. Doing great. Hanging out. Hey, yo, Alfric. Hey, male Nord. Female Nord. Yo, Elslif, General Tullius. There's even the Falmar lady. Sorry, no. Falmar. Bastard. Um, <laughs> right. I guess we all begin. <sighs> Kill Delphine? Mm, I'm pretty sure she's still essential. Um, can you please heal your buddy? No, it takes several days for the companions to fully heal. And there's a chance they die as well when they're injured. Right. Uh, save before making negotiation choices. I'll do my best. I'm going to need... I'm going to need everyone to remember... Chat, can everyone please remember the negotiation options because I've I've forgotten. I hope that we have all come I've here completely forgotten. Ah, oh, the foul more. Your chief Talos hunter. That didn't take long. Here, here. I have every right to be at this negotiation. I need to ensure that nothing is agreed to here that violates the terms okay. of the Where White are all the female Concordats. She's part of the Imperial that. delegation. I forgot you to put on the speech amulet, guys. This I don't think it's going to make a difference. Because I don't think I have to persuade. It's just... In terms of the negotiation, we will never get anywhere. Perhaps this would be a good time to get the Dragonborn's input on this matter. Uh, okay. Um, the evening's beard. To think that I would sit down at the same table with that Valmore bitch. <laughs> uh, you're right. The Valmore will have no business here. I think this is the uh, the I'm correct option, right? On this. Very well, Alfred. Goodbye, Earl and Wen. See you later. The Valmore will treat with whatever government rules Skyrim. We would not think of interfering in your civil war. Well, I mean, you kind of have. Skyrim will never bow to the Thalmor. Unlike your imperial friends here. 
You're lucky I respect the Greybeard's counsel, Galmar. Legacy. Okay. We represent the Emperor. Make Elwyn leave, Riften for Markov, and make well, Ulfric pay the Empire. Let's do proceed? it. I have something to say first. Here we go. The only reason I agreed to attend this council was to deal with the dragon. Yep, that's right, y'all. There's nothing else to talk about. Unless the Empire is finally ready to renounce its unjust claim to rule over the free people. Okay, inside. thank you, Jarl Ulfric. Yep, he's doing his long, long rant. Yep, jeez, this guy. Jarl Ulfric, you're a terrible leader. You don't deserve to be king. Are you done? Did you just come here to make speeches, or can we get down? Yeah, let's get down to business, General Tullis. Woo! Let's get this over with. Are we ready to proceed? Oh, Ulfric and Galmar are Giga Chads. This guy has been Stormcloak peeled. <laughs> oh dear. I ask that you all respect the spirit of High Hrothgar. Do your best to begin the process of achieving a lasting peace. Yep, let's go. Who would like to open the negotiations? Come on. Torgi, thank you for gifting five memberships. I guess we've got a lot of talking here, so this is a fun opportunity to um read the chat we want to control of markov so you here Ulfric? you dare to insult the graybeards by using this council to advance your own position yes yes he does Jarl Elisip. general this is outrageous you can't be taking this demand seriously i thought we were here to discuss a truce indeed Elisip, i said i'd handle it yeah Ulfric, let's go empire woo seriously expect us to give up markarth at the negotiating table you hope to gain in council what you've been unable to take in battle, is that it? I'm sure Jarl Ulfric does not expect something from that. Indeed. Yes, that'd be entirely out of character. I want in return. Wait, Ori, General, you tell me a little about your people. Bosnian traditions aren't particularly traitor. well documented back First in the Imperial City. The Empire repays us for our loyalty. <laughs> I don't suppose Enough. you could be a little more First, specific let's be clear. about what you're asking, Lucy. Companions, so shut up. There's deep lore. I think it's a waste of time. No, it's not, General Tullius. It's important. And deserve a traitor's death. Uh, President 99 says, don't forget to wash yourself for speech things I did forget. I did forget, President 99. all here at your request. I'd like to hear what you think Markarth is worth. How about Riften? The Rift would help secure our communications with Cyrodiil and threaten Ulfric's southern flank. Indeed. The Dragonborn has spoken, Tullius. Markarth will be out. I mean, in my opinion, that's a brilliant trade. Riften is incredible and Markov is... Markov is bad. You disappoint me, Dragonborn. I accepted your invitation on trust in your good name. But it seems you intend to favor... No, I don't. I can see now oh, that this I is not a negotiation. No, it is. Man, probably. I know you, Ulfric. Subject. Those if I hand over around the boss, I'll be ready with cannons. You got Riften, though. You never defeat the Empire, and you know it. But you're willing to sacrifice no, thousands for your it's own selfish ambition. Come on, be happy. Soon enough, I'll have you back What's under the headsman's axe. Charming this time tradition. There won't be any dragon to save you. I suppose candles and singing are such prosaic. The Empire's Osma. fine words are worth nothing. What the Stop. Be quiet. Are you so blind to our danger that He's you can't see me. past your pity disagreement? Yes, Esburn. Sassum. Sassum Esburn. Is he with you, Delphi? If so, I advise you to tell him to watch his tongue. He is with me, and I advise you both to listen to what he has to say before you do anything rash. Yes. Don't you understand the danger? Don't you understand what the return of the dragons mean? Alduin has returned, the world eater. Even now, he devours the souls of your fallen comrades. Yes, indeed he does. He's... Are you stuck? He grows more Ever so slightly. With every soldier <sighs> the Stormcloaks will reign supreme? No, they won't. No, 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 no. Moment in the face of this mortal danger? <sighs> I do like the random dog box. This is actually quite accurate to whenever we hold meetings at our house. Georgie has has to have an input. this truce will help the Dragonborn here put an end to that menace, we both gain. Remember that, Ulfric. Now, back to the matter at hand. You know as well as I do that we can't hand over Markarth on these terms. Damn imperial arrogance. 
Let's hear it. We want compensation for the massacre at Carthwaston. Yes. You slaughtered the very people you claim to be fighting for. True sons of Skyrim would never do such things. Yes. And imperial lies. My men would never stoop to such methods, even in retaliation. This is our order, Antonius. All the blood spilled in this war is on your head. Ooh. So, Dragonborn, what do you say? Uh, if I remember correctly, it's Ulfric should compensate you for Calf Weston, right? Well said. Here we go. For once, you'll actually pay for your crimes. Yes, there we go. I suppose that's the fairest deal we're likely to get. Yes. It seems we may have an agreement. Jarl Ulfric, General Tullius. Okay. We're doing great. The terms currently on the table. Markarth will be handed over to Ulfric's forces. Yep. Jarl Edmund will step down, and Thangvor Silverblood will become the Jarl of Markarth. Indeed. Stormcloaks will withdraw from the rift, allowing Imperial troops unhindered access. Fantastic. There we go. Oh, Maven Blackbriar. Yeah. Send in the Blackbriars. They're great. The Stormcloaks will pay a oh, we did it. For the at they never say what the appropriate compensation was. Um, you both agree to this? The sons of Skyrim will live up to their agreements as long as the Imperium Hold to them. We did it. What about you, Alistair? Are these terms to your liking? Speak up. I'm sure General Tullius is waiting to do your bidding. I have nothing to say to that murderer. General, you've proven yourself a good friend to Skyrim. I continue to trust that you will do your utmost to safeguard our interests. Yay, go yo. Thank you, Jarl Alistair. Slay, Queen, slay. The Empire can <laughs> live with these terms, yes. For a temporary truce, until the dragon menace is dealt with. After that, Ulfric, there will be a reckoning. Count on it. That's the spirit, everyone. Peace for a moment. Right. It's a heavy price for this truce, right? Learn, shout, call, Odaving. How do I do that? Do I speak to you? I'm afraid there's a problem. A serious one. I've discovered who the Greybeard's leader is. Yeah, it's par from next to the war criminal. I don't care. I'm ready to do my part. All well. It's yeah, yeah, yeah. The blade. Yeah. Justice yeah. demands. I anticipated the problem while you were arranging this meeting. An unguessed trove of lost lore. Cross referencing this. Ah, don't. By calling the dragon with a voice, he's not compelled to, but dragons are prideful. Your voice in particular. I think it's very likely that. Ah, okay, what's the dragon's name? Ud Arvin. Just say the word, Winged and my men will help you spring this trap. Amazing, here we go. But the difficulty remains. We learnt it. How to lure a dragon to dragon's reach at all? Uh, do, 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 do. Well, cool dragon? Excellent question. There we go, now yes, we learnt to summon dragon. Detail, have you? Ah, I believe I can be of help here. Hey, did you say something? That's all, all right, prepare mean. trap for Odaving. Right, whereabouts is this? It's over in Whiterun, right? Yep. Yeah. So now we've just got to travel all the way there. Once again, we're going to use the fast travel pack because otherwise I will die. Actually, we could do with a tactical sleep whilst we're here. Um, I think one of one or two of these beds are fine now that we're slightly more accepted by the grey beds. Uh, don't yeet off the mountain, Smith. I won't. You must kill Parfanax. No, I'm not killing Parfanax. Parfanax is completely chill. Um, we love Parfanax. He's Parfo friend. Friend and X. It's his new name. Final fast travel. I know. This is the big one. Um, but we do need a little sleep. Apparently we could use a drink. So let's sleep for a couple hours. Free should be enough, I'm hoping. Please. Please be enough. That's enough. We're, we're feeling rested. World will end in two days. Time for the final fast travel. Oh, let's go. For some reason I can't go into first person anymore. Um, so... I'm just going to not question that at all and hope that this will all be potentially fixed at some point. Um, am I holding like a salmon in my hand? I am. Let me eat a salmon steak. There we go. Yum, 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 yum. Party snacks as a friend. Yeah, we're not going to be mean to party snacks. Oh, I couldn't go into first person because I had a salmon in my hand. This is known. <laughs> all right. Out into the world we go. 
Four. Thank you, Sam Randall, for upgrading your uh, your membership. Dr. Franklin Anderson, thank you for your donation of two dollars. You got a win, Smith. I'll do my best. And Dylan Price, thank you for be becoming a tea leaf again. Right. Um, what mod do you use to make the zoom like Oblivion? I don't know. It's in the pack. Fast travel to Dragon's Reach. It is 9.17 a.m. Will you fast travel, please? Only a couple hours, please, not long. Please, not long. Uh, so it's 9 a.m. Okay, we only lost, like, three hours there. That's okay. That's okay. Where are you? That's like a few minutes. World will end in one day. The world will end in one day! <sighs> da! <laughs> it's, it's fine. We could we could go to Sovereign Guard and defeat Alduin without any deaths and save the world. We have 1.4 days left. Quick, 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 quick. Balgi, we're ready. We're ready, Balgi. It's good to see you. Are you ready to spring the trap? My men stand ready. I'm ready. Let's my trap. Men know what to do. Make sure you do your part. I'm putting my city in your Final day, guys. Let's go. Four. Thank you for all of the likes on the stream. We're gonna do great. If I remember correctly, I need to go down. Where's where's the dragon bit? Where where's the yarl even gone? Where's the... Is, it's like back here, isn't it? Here yeah, it is. Here we go. The Great Porch. We can do this. Thank you, everyone. Okay. The rules are pretty simple. If I remember correctly, I need to literally... It's like pull this, right? Right. Is everyone ready? Everyone ready, chat? Um... We can do this. Drop down a save. We can do this. Use Wabberjack to save the guard. Oh, this guy here. Um, uh, it's okay. He doesn't have to be saved. You do have a plan for luring a dragon. Yes, I do. Yeah. Let's go. Did that work? Did that work? Did we summon dragon friend? Oh, defeat and trap him. Okay, let's give it a try. If I remember correctly, there's a way to cheese this by going in and out of the instance. Oh, goodbye, guard. Yep, that'll do it. Right, so if I do enter Dragon's Reach and then exit Dragon's Reach, I think that spawns him inside the hall. I think that saves us like a few minutes. So let's give it a try. Okay, let's go. Okay, no, that wasn't the case. That's a big shout. Oh, here's the pool thing, though. Oh, jeez, he's using clear skies. Well, we need to use clear skies. Right, let's use Dragon Rent on him once we can. This guard is slightly on fire. Oh, I need to do Dragon Rent. Come on. Oh, that was a bad shot. Jeez, okay, he is actually quite a spicy boy. Uh, but potentially we can do a poison. I am getting slightly stuck on the ledge, which is a problem. No, I just got stuck. Come on, come on, back, 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 back. Oh my god, it's... No, 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 no. Woo! Woo! Critical strike. Um, potion of the marksman. Uh, potion of restoration. Big hit. Big hit. Big hit. Big hit. Another poison. There we go. Critical strike. Big hit. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, we're doing good. We're doing good. 
Come on. Yes, there we go. He's injured. Oh my goodness. What now? How do we do this now? Do we have a chat with him? Do I now get to speak with him? Hello. Oh, now I do the door. You don't need to kill him, Spiff. Okay, lead him inside. Lure him in. Okay, oops. I might have accidentally murdered him. If we, if I accidentally glitch the game, I'm happy to reload the save. That's not too bad. Um, hello. Come inside. Come inside. Come on. Come on in. 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 An ego. Come on back. Everyone, can you can you let him come in, guys? Please. Everyone, come on. Just let him be. Let him be. <sighs> so much ammo and potions wasted. I mean, I might actually re-roll this. You're right. That was a bit silly. Thank you for the reminders, guys. We'll give it another go. We'll give this another try. Spiff never beaten Skyrim confirmed. No, I have beaten Skyrim. It's just it's been over a year since I've done the final quest line of Skyrim. And I'm sorry that I don't remember all of the necessary oh, functions. Right, so back we go. So we literally just need to... Um, you need to step out a bit. Okay. So... God, we got 10,000 people watching us. We can do great. Gonna have to eat these troublemaking companions? I know. Save scumming, shaking my head. Guys, it does, it's, that's not save scumming. Come on, leave your companions outside. Companions, come on in. I don't really want to soft lock the game, which is why I'm happy to do it. Um, if I remember correctly, can I just like wait? If I wait one hour, I think that's what causes it to go, potentially. Oh, is it? what? Both the cultist. <laughs> what the heck is that? Have I got a bow? I cannot wait. There are enemies nearby. I'm accidentally. S My character's glitched out. Yeah, I'm glitched. I have no physical form. Which is minorly a problem. Um, I need to sit down on a chair. And it should reset my animation. There we go. <laughs> Can we kill this cultist, please? Bam. He dead. We did great, everyone. We killed the cultist. Right. Outside we go. Dragon should now be on the floor, I'm hoping. That is one precious hour. I know, but we kind of have to do it. Okay, please be up. He's not here. God damn it. Okay, all of you guys, please. Come on over here. Come on over here. Everyone over here. Come on. Come on. In the corner. In the corner. In the corner. In the corner. Lucian in the corner. In you go. In the corner. Don't fight that dragon. All you need to do is drag him around the dragon and lead him into the fight. Look, you make it sound so much easier than it is. There we go, I think I got him. Alright, back we go. Back, 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 back. Back this way. Into the corner. Actually, wait, if my companions stay up here, they can't really do much. Stay up here, companions. Let him come into the trap. We can't kill him, just let him come into the trap. Into the back, come on. And ego, don't! Okay, fine. Well, I guess an ego can't win this fight anyway. Alright, backing up to the door. He does seem quite interested on fighting literally anyone other than me. But here he comes. He's coming along. Stay focused. Alive. Is that the Yarl saying what over and over again? Your thumb is strong. Oh, hello. Oh, you killed a white run guard and looted his body. Oh, what? 
<laughs> I did a great job, everyone! I did amazing! We did it, everyone! I know, I did amazing. Why are the guards fighting each other? Who are they even trying to fight? The guards are fighting the Jarl. That's pretty funny. We did amazing. That was pure skill. Yep. Thank you. I salute your... Stratagem. cunning in devising such a Brahmin Dole. Stratagem. The Yarl is genuinely just being crazy right now. Also, by the way, Zach uh, Kislow, thank you very much for donating $10. That's very, very generous. That's right, where is he hiding? Many of us among ourselves, of course. Mooney, once Lord Croesus, innumerable. Okay, he's gone to Sovngarde. Let's go. Do you promise to serve me? Croesus. Only this. You have the Thurm. Of course. I could fly you there. But not while imprisoned like this. Onikan Korav. And you free me. Right. Okay, I'll set it free. I will carry you to Skaldafin. He will... Yep. Okay, so now I have to ask you. Hello. Open the trap. Yes, I'm sure. Someone else is gonna have to help you. <laughs> You're right. We're gonna do great. We now just need a zero death skull skull daffin. No, it's fine. It is all part of the Dragonborn's plan. <sighs> Let's go. Right, let's um let's go to the edge and have a chat. Right. Are you ready to see the world as only a Dover can? Yes I am, Mr. Dragon friend. Right, let's drop down a big save. So, it's two thirty four. The world will end in one day. What are the end times? One point three nine days remaining. Are you ready to see the world as only a Dover can? Yes, I am. Can you stop clipping into me? Saran Uth. I'm ready here. Take me to Skoldafen. Let's go. You. See you later, guys. I've saved the game. We're off. Away we go. <laughs> Just run for the portal. You need to run to the portal. I know. I'm aware. So the next fight with Alduin immediately dies. Is as far as I can take you. Okay. I will look for your return. Or Alduin's. Okay, so thank you very much, Dragon Man. Um, so the rules of Skulldafen are pretty, pretty simple, I remember. There's a portal up there. Um, luckily I can do magic and I can do power of summon Ori. Alright. There he is, there's Ori. And then I can do um, whistle to an ego. And he might be able to come to us? No, he can't. Um, right, so we're doing this with just... Oh my god. We're doing it with just Ori. Right. That's fine. That's fine. Um, that was a big miss. Oh, big hit maybe? Yee! Good shot, good shot, good shot. That's what we like to see. I mean, that was probably like a level one. Um... What? What? What is going on? What is that? What is... What is that? What is that? Clear skies, clear skies, clear skies. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? What the hell is... If I die here, it's over. What are you? Oh my... Am I just gonna whirlwind sprint this? Bro, 
Alright, put the bow away. Bring the bow out. I'm invisible. I'm invisible. I'm invisible. I'm invisible. They can't see me. They can see me! Good jump. Oh, you can't full throw down me, my friend. Bow away. Crouch. Bow out. Sneak. They can't see me. He can't see me. They can't see me at all. They can kind of see me. Boss, why are you? What on earth? Um, <laughs> I've I've done I've done some analysis, chat. I've done some analysis, and I appear I appear to have died. Um, oh my god! This means I have. This means I have point. Two days Skyrim remaining. You have point three days left. Oh, I'm back here. Oh my god. Um, oh my god. So we come back here. Mod configuration. End times. This is... This is the end. We have... Point naught four of a day remaining. Oh my god. I know you guys say just run. You you say just run, but you do understand there's a dragon priest at the top of that, right? I think I think this is it. You know what? It's it's simply not possible. So with basically half a day remaining, I think we just have to enjoy Skyrim. We have to remember it for what it was with our the friends we have. So let's just leave White Run. Goodbye, White Run Guard. Goodbye, Preventus of Enki. Goodbye, Hronga. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, Cord. You're my favorite. My favorite man. Go get a mead. Yeah, I think we're going to go to the pub. Just have a sit down at the, uh, the Drunken Mary and wait for all this to blow over. Come on, guys. Come on, gang. Inigo. Need something? We have Lucius, but we don't have Belrin, so I guess Belrin died in solitude and we didn't even notice. We lost two companions in, in the solitude legendary dragon attack. That would make sense. Hey, everyone. Goodbye, Heimsker. Goodbye, Valand. Where's Nazim? Where's Nazim? I've got a score to settle. There's one last thing I can do on this godforsaken planet. It's find Nazim. You look tired, friend. The The family will save us all again. Sure, yeah, I believe in it. It's the end of Skyrim, guys. Point three days or something like that. Where's Nazim? This your bedroom's up here. He's not here. He could be up at the palace. There's a chance of that. What? What? Well, we have problems. Nazim? Ah, here you are. I oh, know this is Sigurd, not Nazim. Uh, do, 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 do. After this world ends and the legacy of Chairman Meow with it, will we have to start over 100 days with another life? Well, maybe, but not today. This is the final stream, after all. There's Argus. Come on in. Where's Nazim? Hi Bjorn, where's Nazim? Is he upstairs? Oh, 
I accidentally used a, a shout in here. Oops. Um, Hunter's Sight. Nazim is not up here. Do, 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 Down we go. Go on, everyone. I guess he's up by the palace. He's in the cloud district. He's in the cloud di district very often, you peasant. Well, I know. <laughs> you have to donate one minute to add one day. Oh, oh I see. Yeah, we do like a subathon Skyrim. Where it's like you have a... Uh... I mean, it's someone in the ground over there. That could be Nazim. Don't think it is, though. Uh, let's go up to the Cloud District. Oh, dear. What is the... Uh, how many days do we... Well, how much time left? 0.364. Oh, my God. Right. Oh, before we kill Nazim, I'm actually going to go to the toilet chat. So, one second. One moment. Entertain yourselves. Please chant Nazim in the uh, chat. Wow, look at that. A chorus of people chanting Nazim. Let's go into the palace and have a look for him. He could be in here. Everyone tell him you can skip the dragon priest. It doesn't make a difference. I don't... I simply don't have enough time. I simply don't. Even if I were to get all the way there, it's just not possible. There's a lady. That's not Nazim. Hello, Preventus. Is he upstairs? Where are you? No, it doesn't look like there's anyone upstairs. What is it? So my brother really did it. The white one would be the toast of Skyrim. Um, yep, no Nazim. No Nazim detected. Excuse me. Unless he's over here on the chair. No, this looks like a normal adventurer to me. The world will end in less than a day. Yes. Oh my god. I'm gonna even find Nazim before the end of the world. Oh my god. At least I can um at least I can absolutely chug a skooma. Let's have a skooma. Or oh, sleeping tree sap. Now let's go skooma. You know, why not? Oh my god, there's a giant mud crab with a hat! What? Skooma's funky. Mud crab chef. Guys, can we please kill mud crab chef? Mud crab chef. What are you doing here? Still got all their limbs? Um, cooking men and myrrh in three easy steps. Thanks, mud crab chef. Guys, drugs are great. The world looks so vibrant now. So vibrant and lovely. Ba -da 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 -da. It doesn't feel like the world's gonna end. High five, so good. High five, God. High five. High five, old man. Mr. Battleborn. Hey there, John Battleborn. Well met, traveler. What brings me what to White Run? I seek my fortune. So it's I'm gonna get it. Woo! It's the That's end of the world. Skooma, it's the taste sensation, ladies and gentlemen. Oh yes, it is. Do 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 do. Maybe he's on the back streets behind the blacksmith. We've got Bridget Battleborn. There's female elder. Hello, Lava the Feeble. I don't suppose you could do a reading and see when the end of the world is. The real album was the friends we made along the way. Sure. Sure. I genuinely can't even find... 
Damn clever idea you had, I have to admit. I can't even find Azim. Unless is he here? No, these guys are just merrily watching everything, right? <sighs> Need more skooma? I know. Grace of I know. I wonder actually if the skooma can summon him. Let's have another chug. Do 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 do. Have a little sip sip. Ooh. Ooh, it's funky. Ooh, the sky is different. What if I had another? Whoop. Whoop, I just fell over and I woke back up again. You passed out due to too much skooma. Did that change the time? Nope, we're still fine. But don't drink too much skooma, kids. There are 69 special effects from taking skooma. Lose yourself. Wow. Nazim is in Skoldafen? Of course he is. Of course he is. Are you winning, son? Yeah, we're about to win. Look at how vibrant it all is. Yeah, thank you. Let me do a bit of parkour. Woo, parkour. Wee. And a little parkour down. There we go, lovely. Oh, actually, Nazim could be over at his farm. We can try that out. Do 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 do. Nazim, where are you, my friend? Where's my special man? My special little Nazim. Ah, there's his farm. I remember now. John says next challenge. This, but with Skyrim together. Any person's death means a subtraction of a day. You could even ma make it a competition. I don't think you quite understand just how difficult this mod pack is and how unstable Skyrim together is. He's already dead, Spiff? Wait, did we already kill Nazim? I don't remember killing Nazim. His chill for a farm, which is Nazim's, right? I do have the key for it, which would imply he's already dead. Yes. Um. Yeah, I... I do believe we've already killed Nazim. Oh no! He's right here! Nazim is right here! Wow, guys. I mean we have this we have this poison that does how much is it? Oh yes, 1800 damage. Well it it only seems fair that we kill Nazim. Oh miss, oops. He dead. Nazim is dead. Nazim is dead. He's dead. He's dead. We did it, everyone. He's dead. 1,800 damage for my Nazimi boy. My Nazimi boy. Look at his sleepy eyes. Look at his sleepy body. Goodbye, Nazim. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, wait. Unusual harvest. Mmm, yum, 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 yum. Yum, yum, yum. Thank you, Nazim. Ah, we beat the game, everyone. We beat the game. Amazing. Yes. The world feels so much brighter without Nazim. <laughs> Mod config, how many, how much time do we have left, Mod config? 0.26. <laughs> oh my god. Skooma. Yes, we can have another one of those. Hmm. Oh, it spawned in old Nana. Hello there. Hello. Hello. You know where I am, I can you know where I can find some skooma, right? Tell me. Okay. Where are you? Hello. Well Who are you? Where's my head? I never even I'm just a poor old alchemist. Can I help you with some herbal needs? Tea leaves? Oh, tea leaves. Your head looks rather big. Oh, Besides, don't act so surprised. Um, I was a beauty in my day, dearie. Popular. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to offend you. Let's talk. A stamina potion, maybe? Oh. You just let old Nana know if you need anything. Sure, surprise sorry, me. Love. There's no time. Oh, there's no time. Goodbye. Goodbye. 
Goodbye, old Nana. Whoop. And she's gone. Incredible. What a lovely experience that was. Oh. Would I like a cup of tea? Yes, Mango, I'd love a cup of tea. Chat, it's the end of the world, but Mango is still making me cups of tea. Now that's a lovely sign, isn't it? Uh, you know what? We never even bought a house. We can rectify that. We've got enough time to enter the property market. I hear that buying a house right before a dragon apocalypse is actually a good idea. It's a surefire investment, in fact. If you know the world's about to end, what a better time than to invest in property. Yes, splendid idea. Do 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 do. Still have 19 minutes to do whatever. Well, I think it's actually like 10 minutes, but sure, 19 minutes. Ah, what a lovely bit of skoomers. Reload and try again. Yes, I mean, it only took me, what, 44 hours to get here in the first place? We could just go again. Have you guys got another, another time for a short stream after this? Buying a home in this economy? Yes. Uh, Emily the Gamer Girl says, are you and Mango married? Yes, we are. She's my wife. It's very exciting. It's great. Mango is absolutely glorious. I mean, Mango is spelled M4NG0. She's got, you know, a gamer tag username, but that's just how Mango works. Um, she used to be a streamer. You can find her Twitter. Um, she mostly posts memes, I guess. And also pictures of me. How can I help? Because I'm amazing. Right. Um, hey, what Sold. You know where I can find some skooma for research you purposes? Me to that. Yes, for research. How does he not? Skooma, yes, give it to me. You surely have some. No, no skooma. What a shame. What a shame, everyone. Don't give up, Spiff. Do another run for the next stream. No, 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 no. Yes. Hello. Farewell. You're a sad, sad lady. Goodbye, sad lady. Mr. Mango and Mrs. Spiff. Yes, that's how marriage works. <sighs> we Right, in we go. Oh, Mango, stop streaming. Yeah, um, it just, it, well, she still kind of appears in stuff. Like, she sometimes appears in my streams and videos, but streaming can be pretty rough. Um, yeah. Right, where's, the, where's, where's my boy? Where's my boy? Is he up at the top? Where's the steward? Steward? Mr. Steward? Did I miss him? I think I probably missed him. Do, 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 do. You're just an adventurer. Varengar? Not you. Oh, here you are. I found you, Preventus. Um. Hey, Preventus. That beast is gone from Dragon's Reach. I need me some skooma, the, the imported stuff. Just one last time. Got any? Go away. Please. Oh. I serve Jarl Balgruf, uh, I'd like to purchase a house in the city for 5,000 gold. There's a house available right now. I'll Under take it. Here's the key to your new home. Thank you. Breeze home. Guys, we've got a new home. Oh, it's amazing. What exploits did you use to get Mango to marry you? I have no idea, because she's incredibly beautiful. Um, and very intelligent. And I wasn't even a YouTuber when I met her and was in a relationship with her. So it's not even like me being a, a giga amazing game exploiting celebrity helped. Yes. You know what, child? Hello. Hey, you know where I can find some scuba? Oh, the child doesn't know. Hey, um, here, have some money. That's fine. Why are you begging? I could adopt you if you want. I have a house. Oh, I, I don't have room for you. Oops. Lol. <laughs> One of my final acts before the end of the world. Tell a child I'll adopt her, but they'd say, Oops, no room. Sorry. Where even is my home? Is this Bree's home? No, that's Ronya's house. Can't forget Ronya's house. Is this? No, this is um, Yazolda's house. Goodness, the world is really ending now. It is raining like nobody's business. Breeze home? Is this one breeze home? No, that's all for the feeble. Yes, that makes sense. This one breeze home. Yes, it is. We made it to breeze home, guys. Ah, lovely. 
Look at our home. It's got a table. It's got a door. It's got a bed. It's got some wine. Yes. Oh, it's even got a double bed. We've got two beds. Oh, we... So when I told the child we don't have space for her, we definitely do have space for her. That's pretty funny. Oh, shoot around Josh donates eight dollars of convict money. Thank you very much from Australia. That's very nice of you. Uh, it is worth an immense amount just for the generosity you show. Skooma now. Okay. One last chug on this old Skoomy. Where is it? Where's the Skooma? Mr. Skooma, where are you? There you are. Chug, 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 chug. Mmm, you close your eyes and it feels like you're somewhere else. Yes. Oh. What? What is going on here? What on? Um, my speech is down to 16. <laughs> what is going on here? There's no living beings around here. Oh, look. This is... What the heck is... What the heck is any of this? What is... Search the barrel. Stale bread. Stand in a circle. What the heck is going on? What's the red door? What are any of these doors? Open and close. What the hell is going What? And it's over. That's fine. Oh, thank you for the cup of tea, Mango yes. Chat. Can you be my father? You're the best. Can you be my father? Lucia... It's the end of the world, but let's go for it. I, I, I think I do have space, maybe. Oh, well. Oh, I, I still don't have room. Is there genuinely no way for me to expand child room? Oh, well, that's fine. How much time left? Uh, we have 0.19. Maybe we have enough time to get uh, to adopt the child before the end of the world. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I don't know why I went into the Skyrim back rooms. You could have finished the game, but you chicken out. Sorry, 0.3 days remaining. And I have to fight three dragons, a dragon priest. Oh, and then Alduin. Oh, and also navigate the entirety of Sovngarde. Yes, we could have done that in 0.3 of a day. Go to Preventus. I know I'm going to Preventus. We're going. You can buy the upgrade. Preventus! I would like to have a, own the child. I'd like to decorate my home. And of course, now, what would you like um, to do? Do, 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 Children's bedroom, 250 Very gold. Well. The home has no other decorations or infrastructure, but we can at least put a child in it before the world collapses and it gets all burnt down to ground. It's been great. Die standing, then live kneeling. What do you mean? I'm not living kneeling, I'm living whilst on drugs. There's a difference. <sighs> Here we go. Preventus has been able to somehow magically build the child's room in like half a day. Well, in about five seconds. Hello, Lucia. There we go. I'm going to adopt you. Yes, I've got a house in Whiterun. Yes, there we go. There we go. We have a new worker to fight dragons for us. You're going to do great. DQB, thank you very much for a donation of $50. Today, Spiff, your videos are always highlights of your day. Keep up the awesome work and keep on being fantastic. Feel free it's to awesome use this for some Yorkshire sure. gold. Of course. Thank you very much. I will, of course, use all of that money for Yorkshire tea. Yes, here we go. We now have a home. At least the girl won't be an orphan when it happens. Exactly. And look, we have... Where is the kid's bedroom? Is it this down here? Is this the kid's bedroom? Yes, it is. Oh, look, it's kind of cute. We can have up to two kids, I guess. Or what is this it's person so taking one? That armor. I realize it protects. Hello, yes. you. Um. Can you please stop singing? Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize I was being annoying. Yes, there we go. Stop. Hey, Lucia. It's everything I could have hoped for. It's literally a bunch of I empty boxes, weird toothy child. It's I can't thank you enough. Your family is a weird wood elf that yes, eats corpses yes. 
a weird demon cat, Lucian the friendly fire team killer 5000, and Gladys the noise box. Hello, I need some skooma. Do you have any child? No, my child, please, you let down your father. You've done. Was that the option of you've done scuba before? That's crazy. Um. Uh, I've got something for you, Lucia. What is it? Ah, oh, sweet roll. Isn't that amazing? Thanks. I'm such a good father. Tree in the park looks so sad. I feel sorry. I feel sorry for that as well. Let's actually let's let's play a game. What do I want to play? Hide and seek. You stand right there and count to ten. No peeking. Ready. Okay, no peeking, go. Okay, you're it. Find someone. So she's going to go and hide. I'm going to go ahead and try and find her. Okay, I'm going to count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's go. Does time stop in Sovereign Guard? No, it does not. Uh, right. Now I have to find the child. However... I do have the ability to find. Where is the child? I think I see him running. No, is this my child? Got her. Where? <laughs> I did it. Found you. you got me. Ten, I did. Nine, eight, seven, Ooh. Six, Okay, hide. She can't find me. Invisibility bow. From a science perspective, she should not be able to find me. Although the corgi does kind of give it away. Well, she is going for it. She is really going for it. Oh. Hey, there we go. This is how we do it. We hide with invisibility. Is it fair to play hide and seek against a child when you have access to invisibility magic? I don't know, but I can do it. my team barrel rolling oh completed you're it what? find someone I did it I won take that child I did it um, uh, I can't really give you like sleeping tree sap can I well if you say so thanks Thanks for talking to me. I did a great job. Adventure calls. Ooh, it's time for me to head out. I just get so excited thinking about it. You're so lovely. Goodbye, young Bye, one. Papa. There we go. We did amazing. Did I just have chatter check added? What on earth is that? Is that like a bonus? What? Oh, what a great job. Oh, <laughs> uh, you know, actually, before I go, Anigo. Actually, no, we'll okay. use Lucian. Could hey. One fire no. They want you to kill this one. Hello, Ori. Yes. Um, here, use this. One in all of Ori, use I this. Love. I can give Ori basically anything in my inventory, right? So let's give her... Let's give her the one, the only... Oop. Sleeping tree sap. <laughs> Where is the sleeping tree sap? Can I get her to drink poison? Sure, let's give it a go. Um, <laughs> it does seem a bit crazy, but I think drugs are better, right? Um, Potion of the Shroud. Oh, I had that in my inventory. I could have used that. Sort by name. Where is... Do 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 uh, we SL solution Oh we don't have any sleep we can't give it to her Give her Nazim's flesh uh, apparently she doesn't want that I can give her a bowl of mammoth cheese I can make it eat a potato there we go you can have a potato Ori has consumed potato Inigo Here use this Oh, I can't make you use anything, of course, because your inventory is still bugged. Let's go buy some skooma from the cats before we die. You had plenty of time for another attempt? No, I did not. Chat, you are mad. Absolutely mad. Oh, I 
Can we play a song for the end of the world? Oh, I suppose we could. Uh, Aga oh, I missed this donation, actually. Uh, Aga Wagga, thank you very much for £50 to say lobbying Yorkshire Tea to give Spiff one more day. I'm afraid we can't. Even with your generous donations, we simply cannot add one day. I started this challenge, I set my own rules, and I've been following them. I know I can change my own rules on a whim, and sometimes I do, but this feels appropriate. Now for a fair price. Of course, of course. Let's see your skooma supply. I've got gold, please, I need skooma. Indeed it does. <laughs> what have you got? Everslur, Eversnow? That seems pretty spicy. Ten skooma? Ooh. What would you like? You can have, um, Saffir Soul Trapping. You want some... You want some expensive stuff? I've got a dragon claw you can have. There you go. Don't need that anymore. Amethysts. Some ingots. Splendid. Thank you. I'm just going to go... <sighs> Sit by the fire, potentially. It's just a nice place to be, guys. Isn't it? For the end of the world, with my cat people, let's take off all of this armor. We don't need to wear it all. Just trip down to what a cat should be. There we go. Here I am, the ultimate cat warrior. The greatest amongst the land, some would say. Let's have a little sippy of that skooma. Yum, 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 yum. Oh. Oh. This would summon the cow. I don't feel stressed anymore. Because how could you feel stressed when Giga Cow is here? The Giga Purple Cow of Friendship. Our final friend in these turbulent times. <laughs> mm. What a cute little guy. What's he even doing up there? We don't know, he's just a cool little guy. Can we kill Giga Cow? Is this even possible? Does Giga Cow even have a physical form? I don't even know if he is. Is he just some kind of illusion? I think he might be. There's a horse over there. I think that's the horse we're meant to tame, if I remember correctly. Where's, oh, Giga Cow's gone. Just as quickly as he arrived. Wow. What a hero. Um, I guess we could kill one last person. He's your new mount, I wish. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Right, let us, um. I suppose we could do the thing Doug Doug really wanted, which was kill the carriage driver, right? Let me get, uh, quickly pop on my invisibility. Oh, a little bit higher. And there we go, he's dead. Rip. Not even a single bounty and everything. Wow. Incredible. Poor guy just chilling here. Sorry, Bjorlem. Really sorry, Bjorlem. But, you know, at least you get to be one of the last. Anyone else still sticking around? Maybe a guard or two we could uh, evaporate before the end? I mean, it spares them of having to live through the end of the world, right? Like, if anything, we're doing them a service. It's getting dark, though. The world will end in less than a day. Yep. Oh, it's Draloff the Bastard. We found Draloff the Bastard. My men, go. Get him. Oh, I can dodge. Oh, I can dodge. You can't get me, Draloff the Bastard. Level 34. This can be our final boss of the game. He's dead. We did great, guys. Draloff the Bastard being killed. Yeah, we can't kill Alduin, but... Pff, that's one less bastard in the world. <laughs> And if anything, that's a good service for humanity. Who's this dead person? Oh, an assassin. How oh, exciting. Instructions and everything. Johnny Law, thank you for your one pound donation. It's Wabberjack time. Oh yeah. Gladys, Corgi, please. I need to carry something. 
I would like that uh, Wabberjack back, please. Thank you very much. Do 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 do. It's Wabberjacking time. Let's find ourselves a friend. Oh, it's a chicken. Hello there, chicken friend. The chicken exploded. <laughs> oh, rip chicken. Um, last witness kill. Wow, this guy didn't even notice the chicken explosion. Well, the white run guard did explode. And then he's exploded again. And then he has been iced. And then finally, lightninged. Poor, poor guard. <sighs> Where do I want to be for the end of the world? Do I want to go to Riverwood? Now, I feel like standing atop Dragon's Reach is still a lovely part of the world. Just a nice little spot. Really is a nice little spot. Come on, everyone. Come on. More skooma? Okay. Okay, more skooma. Yum, 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 yum. Warn the Yarl of Whiterun. And the Hawkers. Oh, no. Are there Hawkers attacking Whiterun? Oh, we must be quick. We must warn him. We must warn the Yarl of, of the imminent Hawker invasion. Swift, we must be quick. Oh, uh, Pyromaniac says, serious question, I've never tried it. Can you disenchant the Wabberjack? No, you cannot disenchant the Wabberjack. Uh, it is actually impossible. Um, several unique enchantments in the game are impossible to disenchant. Unfortunate, which is unfortunate, because it would be really nice if you could disenchant everything. But yeah, there is a reason for balance, because several of them would just be a bit too broken. Come on, in we go. Is it a skooma hallucination? No, no, this is a real threat. There's there's a hawker invasion. We've got to warn the Yarl. Up to the Dragon's Reach we go, using the fast way. Failed, we failed to warn the Yarl of Whiterun. No! Does that mean he's been murdered by the hawker invasion? Oh, we tried. That was the true threat of Skyrim. We really did try. <laughs> uh, right, up we go. We into Dragon's Reach. This is when we go inside and he's been killed. Have you ever tried Skooma IRL? No. What? Yo, Belgraf, are you okay? Is he okay, guys? Where's the Yarl? Well, I guess if he's busy, we can um, we can have a little ponder in his chair, can't we? <sighs> what a lovely, what a lovely area to see the end of the world. 0 0.0679, Wow, chat, this is the end. Um, this has been one of the ultimate experiences I've ever had in Skyrim, and. I'm genuinely really grateful that I got to spend all of it with you. Um, this series, to last four point, well, 44 hours of Skyrim has been incredible. But here we are. We made it to a lovely spot with all of our friends. Gladys the Corgi, by far my favorite companion. Inigo, a close second. You are looking followed good, by friend. Weird Man, Cheers. whose name Cheers. I even forget, and then Weird Wood Elf Cannibal Lady. It's been amazing having you here, genuinely. I guess we just have one quick sip of Suma before the end. Everything looks different, but I don't feel stressed anymore. Wow. Yeah. Everything does look funky. But what a great day it's been for the world to end. And for us to end by having a half-naked Khajiit sat on the throne of Whiterun. Long live Chairman Meow. The end is nigh, but I am Nyan, and this has been the ultimate way to play to Skyrim, in my opinion. I was born to sit there, and ego. I was made for this chair. Ah, oh, Macaulay Taylor, thank you very much for 50 gifted memberships here on the final day. So we failed the challenge, says St. Shion. Yes, we did. 100 days. 58 deaths or something later, 
We got to here. We tried. We got so close to the end of the world. But unfortunately, it was not far enough. It was not. We really did give it our best go. I, I had many moments. Fendel's death. Our first ever friend we made. Then Janassa. Our second friend we made. Dead. Anigo. Great fun. Of course, we then had Lydia. Lydia died, unfortunately, in potentially a freak-friendly fire accident involving an arrow. That was indeed a shame. And then we were joined by Bjorl, Bjorl man, and there was also another man, uh, some kind of like Nord man who was Nord Nordinson. He was just a thug, uh, a guy with like a big old bit of heavy armor and a greatsword, and he definitely did okay. Uh, but he died. I remember in a dungeon, uh, we had to loot his body and eat his corpse. I remember that. Um, yes. I know you guys were saying 20 minutes was enough time to defeat the finish the game. It wasn't. It really wasn't. But I think we can walk outside to finish this game. Come on, everyone. Out we go. Onto the steps of Dragon's Reach. Past all these white run guards, shields, and all of that nonsense. Lydia always dies, indeed. Svend? Yes, that was his name. Svend, I think. I remember Svend. He was indeed someone I remembered. Look at this. The air is chilly. I don't have any clothes on, but you there. Where are you? Where are you? I'm right here, Falkvir. You should get yourself a torch. Like I, I should. I should do that. Oh, Skyrim, you beautiful game. Genuinely, such a lovely game. Absolutely amazing. Oh, dear. Oh, oh god, the mud crab chef is back, but he's even stronger. Um, friends? Is he even violent? He seems actually quite friendly. Well, I guess we get to enjoy mud crab friend at the end of the world. Ah, what a nice day. What a great day for the end of the world. Use the cool storm shout right now. Oh, why not? Storm cool. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, the end times are upon us, but there's a crab, and he's cool, and he's coming for me. Hello, crab friend. Goodbye, crab friend. Oh, Gladys is now getting attacked by lightning. Watch out, Gladys. Lightning is bad. Please be careful. And ego also, watch out for the lightning. And you, Gladys. Oh, this game is indeed perfectly balanced. Watch out, guys. It's, um, it's a bit zappy outside here. Yeah, we are on the same side, Inigo. Just, oh, Gladys. Get you back up. Come on. Gladys, come back up. Come on. Give you a healing potion. Oh, and another one. And there we go, another one. Gladys is back. There we go, that's more like it. Uh, Twitch is currently being broken by a, running a world record hype train. Um, I think it's something you'd like to test slash discuss at some point in the future. Yeah, I don't really want to mess with Twitch um, at all, in my opinion. But yes. Wolfiekin says, Damn it, Smith. Ha <laughs> Do you know how distracting it was watching your zombie apocalypse video with you calling out Mr. Wolfiekins? Oh, thank you, Wolfiekins, for the donation. Look, Wolfiekins is just a great name. I love... It's such a common name for my uh, my characters, Wolfiekins. Oh, dear. 100 days in Starfield next? No. I would need, like, uh, some kind of insane Raid Shadow Le Legend style, like, sponsorship deal to, um, to pay for that. Jeez. For... Gladys, you're doing great. Gladys has suffered permanent injuries. No, she hasn't. She's an essential NPC. It's quite impressive that Gladys keeps getting destroyed by lightning. Honestly, she's built for it. She's a powerful being. Why is everything moving so fast? Oh, time has slowed. Oh, no. Yes. Everything else is going faster. I'm going slower. Oh, no. This brings along the end of the world faster, doesn't it? Oh, beans. Quick, Shrine of Talos. Mm, yes, pray. Pray for the Shrine of Talos. Oh dear. Stand up. That was a very slow blessing process. This truce with the storm cloaks won't last a fortnight. Indeed it won't. There you are. Alright. Oh, there's the two moons up there. 
This is quite fun. Careful. Sorry, Lucian. I was here, chat. I was here. You were here. We were all here. The end of the world as we know it. How much time is left? Jeez, this end time is... Um, oh, the end is nigh. Right. I don't know what that means, but that sounds rough. Um, Chat, this is the end of the world, I guess. This is how democracy dies. Not with... Not with chaos, but with thunderous applause, I guess. Summon a dragon. Yeah! We can do that. Oh, actually, I guess we have to wait a few minutes because we did the big storm shout, right? Do, 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 do. The end is nigh. I was here. The world will end. It will. Where were you, my friend? Is the elf lady dead? Did we kill the elf lady with our lightning? I think we must have, because I don't see her around at all. Yeah. Cool. That's great. We did it, everyone. Spiff, if I remember the mod, Aldrin has, was supposed to come fight you and you beat him, and the countdown gets uh, request, uh, gets increased. Is that genuinely the case? Whoop. Um. Nope. I don't think that's quite how it works. I really don't think that's quite how it works. We failed the end times. That's it. Alduin slays you and subjugates the world. Game over, chat. Game over. Well, that's the end. What is the, uh, what's the, what's the freeze time command? I can't remember what it is, because I want to explore the world. Um, Skyrim, freeze time command. It is TFC1. Here we go, TFC1. This, I think, freezes time and gives us free camera, right? Oh, it hasn't given us free camera. But it has frozen the time. Okay, yeah, okay. Looks like we don't get free camera. Because we're dead. Oh my goodness, we're really dead. That's the end of the game, ladies and gentlemen. That's the end of the game. To the main menu we go. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. Um, it has been one hell of a adventure into Skyrim. And even though we didn't win, we did do amazing. I think we did fantastic. I think even though Skyrim has been destroyed, it's the end of the world as we know it. Alduin has won. We had an adventure. And I'm glad that we got to do it together. And I hope you all enjoyed it and you enjoyed the experience along the way. If you're new and you've just tuned into the stream for some reason, then there are seven streams before this one to go and watch. Although you now know that I don't win. But still, we're finally awake, ladies and gentlemen. Alduin has won. He was a hell of a good fight. And I'm glad to have attempted to fight him along with all of you today. Thank you for all of the likes. Especially thank you to all of the donations. The Real Munin donates two euros to say all hail Alduin. The Wolfikins, thank you. The Ninja, thank you. Macaulay Taylor, thank you very much for gifting 50 memberships. That was incredibly generous. Thank you, Gimanis. Oh, thank you, Things We Should Know. Bluish Ghost, Agawa Waga, Nathan Wagner, Dikubi, Madwolf023, there's there's a lot of donations I'd have to read through, actually. There's actually, like, uh, over a hundred of them. I don't even know if I have time for that. <laughs> but thank you all, everyone, for watching. Um, we didn't attempt it, we ran. We we did, we gave it a go. We had 45 minutes to win, 
You could have tried. We could not have tried. That was, you have, if you think you could have done better, you get yourself to that point and you give yourself 20 minutes to go beat the game. Good luck. And if you do it, record yourself. I'd love to see you try. In fact, you know what? I'll give you my save file. How's that? I'll put my, I'll put my save file on the uh, Discord. And then if anyone can do it, hats off to you. The real treasure was the donations made along the way. Indeed it was, hack puppies. <laughs> Luke Smithers, thank you very much. Jumped on to see you die at the end. Can't wait to see the vault later. It's a hell of a story, and I'm glad to have enjoyed it all with you. But I'll see each and every one of you in the next one. Have a lovely day. And goodbye for now. Farewell, everyone. Farewell. It's like 40 minutes. It was not 40 minutes. I can l literally look back. Okay, it was actually like 40 minutes. Okay, that's true. Yeah, it, it was actually 40. We had 40 minutes running around doing drugs. Uh, without cheats, by the way. Yes, of course. Without cheats. Anyway, farewell. I'll see all of you in the next one. Have a lovely day. And goodbye for now. Ah, what an adventure.